and welcome to Live and Uncut. My name is Nicholas, Tau Nick as sometimes people call me. Today, I am not Tau Nick, I am Dean Steeler Nick. And I am in the studio with Steve. My buddy Steve is here. Say hi, Steve. Hi, everybody. We don't often get to have Steve as much in the studio as we want. No, I unfortunately uh, work a, a fairly demanding job. I'm a, I'm a teacher at a, at a high school. And um, it's just one of those things where unfortunately, I'm not always available, especially during the weekdays, but right yeah. now it is our summer vacation. And so we're and, taking uh, advantage of Steve. Yeah, taking advantage of the fact that I'm here all the time. I know Tack is not <laughs> as excited that I'm here as much. I've ruined a lot of things since getting here. I've actually broken something. Sorry, Tack. But, uh, What's yeah, you broken? It, I don't really want to talk about it. It's downstairs. What have you broken? I hit it the second I broke it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll discuss your performance later. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but we are playing a 40K game today. Uh, we are playing um, a custom, well, not a custom mission. We are playing, we are playing one of the Tacoma missions, actually. Actually, yeah, we're playing one of the Tacoma missions. Steve so. recently got back from Tacoma. It was yeah. a, a big tournament. Yeah, I had way too much fun in Tacoma, that yeah. is for sure. So if any of you were down there and you came up uh, to say hello to me, I really, really appreciated that. Uh, I know sometimes in the middle of games, it's really hard to stop and, <laughs> and start talking. But uh, whenever I was walking around, I was always very, very excited to meet one of the Play On fans. So it was, uh, yeah, it, it was a lot of fun. Um, yeah. And I've come back, so they, we, GW actually did this really awesome thing. It's really cool. Where they, they made uh, these like cards and uh, the cards have three set uh, like a mission, a primary mission, a mission rule, and then a deployment layout, and they kind of predetermined them. Uh, so we're playing mission three. So this was the last day, the last game on the first day, and uh, we're playing Purge the Foe, um, uh, which is kind of like the uh, control more and yep. kill more mission. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, Chilling Rain, nice and easy. There's no extras that we need to keep track of. Uh, and then we're playing the uh, cru Crucible of Battle. So we've got our corners, which we're setting up in right now. Yeah. Um, and uh, I'm playing my Imperial Fists, the Banana Boys. They're coming in today. I'm very excited about it. <laughs> oh, and look at that. TN Always uh, Fun is starting it off and giving me a great time to talk about uh, what is different about this stream than maybe some other streams you might have watched. So. At Play On, we love playing games, we love playing 40K, uh, but we also love involving the audience. And yeah. this is a way that you can be involved in this stream. It also acts as a bit of a fundraiser for the channel. Yeah. Advertising dollars on YouTube does not pay the bills. No. And so joining our Patreon, our YouTube membership, or supporting uh, events, our streams such as this with Super Chats goes a long way to letting us keep going, uh, uh, paying for all the stuff that it takes to make these videos. Um, and but. Not only does it support the channel, but you actually get to interact with this game. If you haven't noticed, we have a sniper right here on the field. Yeah. Um, he's right here. Now, he is he is uh, Omnivision. He can see the entire board. And basically, every time we get to a total of $50 in Super Chat yeah. donations, um, so if you donate five, two, a penny, yeah. um, whatever. So, uh, whatever it is, it uh, goes towards the total. We keep track. And every time we get to $50, that sniper shoots. Yeah at you guys' choice. Yeah. So your choice. You could shoot at one of our targets, and so we have a special profile for it. We kind of loosely base it off the Vindicator Assassin rules. Yeah. It automatically hits, so, so no, no It basically has torrent. It basically has torrent. Um, it has anti-everything, too. Yeah. <laughs> so it's just gonna wound and critical everything on a two-up, which means it's gonna be dishing up mortals, because uh, yeah. it does have devastating wounds, which means giving it anti-everything on a two plus means that uh, it's going to wound, it's gonna crit, and it's just gonna dish out mortals. D3 at mortal the, wounds. D3 mortal wounds yeah. at the whim of the chat, <laughs> right? Yes, yeah, so the uh, Imperial Fist, Lemony Fresh, they really are. So we, uh, thank you very much for that donation. We are $10 closer, so uh, when we get to $50, so $40 more, we yep. will fire the sniper. We yeah. usually do that at the end of a phase. We don't interrupt the game too much. Yeah. Um, um, and uh, uh, just as a caveat, if you're looking for a highly competitive stream, this isn't it. No, <laughs> this is not it. There are it. some great channels you can go check out, like uh, Tabletop Titans, I think does a great job of it. Yeah, they do uh, a really good Lee job. Dembski does a great job yeah. uh, at his, his streams. Uh, Vanguard Tactics does a great job. Oh, yeah. We Steven, had Vanguard Steven recently. Box is yeah. fantastic. So th those are all great. If you're looking for that more competitive, uh, hardcore, yeah. But if you're looking to have a good time and have some fun this is and, the place to be. and learn and learn learn some parts of the game, yeah, this is the place to this be. This is the place to be. Place to be. We're, and 
thank you so much for joining us. We're glad to have you here. Yeah. Um, lastly, before we go too further, we do have to mention, we do have a sponsor of the episode, and that is Frontline Gaming. Um, Frontline Gaming basically provides us an affiliate link, and that's how they sponsor the episode. If you are looking for your uh, Warhammer terrain or mats, the terrain and mats we're playing with on this board are Frontline Gaming. Yeah. Uh, they have some great designs. Um, the terrain, this is actually pre-painted. It's basically yeah. this, like uh, printed on. It actually looks pretty good. Yeah. Um, if you go to this link in the description below, you can, you, if you use that affiliate link, it supports the channel. Um, yeah. You can also buy Wargaming aids. You can buy your miniatures there, yeah. especially in the U.S. Um, you can even buy your tickets to events like, uh, like Tacoma? No. Uh, no, Tacoma, no, was, Tacoma, was, a, Tacoma was a GW event. But they did just have, uh, I believe it was the Lone Star Open down right. in Texas. Right, so right. So they, they did just uh, do that major event. And they run events all over the United States. And so if you're in those areas, check it out. See what's up. If you want to go to some of those events, uh, Warhammer tournaments, regardless of what level of player you you think you are, deem yourself to be, are a great way to yeah, learn and socialize, they and they can be a lot of fun if you're going in to have fun. Yeah. All right, so we're in the middle of deploying right now. Um, as I said, I've taken the Gene Stealer Cults. Steve has playing the Imperial Fists. Yes, I There is am. a Gene Stealer Uprising, and I'm going to walk you through my list really quickly as I deploy here. Yeah. In reserves, I have a unit of acolytes with demo charges. I love it. Um, and uh, and stuff like that. And yep. I have a unit of neophytes, ten neophytes. Yep. Um, I've also got a primus that is attached to those acolytes in yep. reserves, so that lets them reroll those hit rolls. Sounds so good. Quite nice. Um, then on the board right here, I have a big unit of ten bikes yeah. with those demo charges. They're sneaky. They're fast. They're awesome. I love, I love the bikes. I'm loving it. Um, I'm gonna play them all right on the line here. They've got an attached sniper on them. Okay. Um, and uh, then I also have a unit of aberrants with an abominant because Woo. they're so freaking awesome. They're just very angry. Very, yeah, very they're angry. They're so awesome. Yeah. Um, and they're so survivable. Very survivable. They're very good. Which means I'm actually gonna put them. Uh, Oh, TN, always fun. Sorry, moving. Steve for the win. And cool, 39, 875. Hi, Nick and Steve. This will be fun. Chat for the win, guys. We'll decide shot later. All right, cool. You decide where that shot's going. Woo, we've already got our first shot. So um, let's put a dice beside the sniper so we know we've got an upcoming shot. And uh, we're just finishing deploying right here. Yep. Uh, we usually try to deploy as much as we can before the stream starts, just to keep it going right ahead. Now you've got, why don't you go through your army there? Yeah, so while you finish your deployment, uh, because I, I Sorry, I apologize, I actually didn't finish going through my army. Oh, okay, be uh, fast. Yeah, so I've got a unit of uh, gene stealers that are infiltrating up here um, with a patriarch, which I seem to have misplaced. I'll have to find the patriarch, oh here he is. With a patriarch uh, leading them. Um, 10, 10 gene stealers, I'll have to set them up a little bit nicer there in a second. And uh, Saboteur, uh, infiltrating all well, okay. right on the objective over here. Sounds good. Um, right on the objective over here. And uh, yeah, I've got, uh, uh, sorry, and uh, uh, allied Lehman Russ and an allied Rogaldorn. Ooh. I have to show off this Rogaldorn really quick and then I promise I won't play it for the more. This is a special, 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 special miniature. Watch this. <laughs> Look, the turret moves, and the uh, the actual miniature moves too. <laughs> That's so silly. It's I love awesome. it. I love it. <laughs> it's so silly, and I love it. Um, that was supplied to it. Oh wow, I'm blanking on the name. Dude, I gotta get the name. Um, you, you describe as your army. All right, while so I get you the name. you look that up. Uh, alrighty, so I have uh, brought a Gladius task force. Uh, leading my Gladius task force is a uh, Janarth Lysander, which is awesome. Uh, and then I have a Primaris Tech Marine hanging out with those Dreadnoughts. And then I've got two uh, battle line units of intercessors, uh, both uh, all kitted out with bolt rifles, very Imperial fisty. Uh, then after that, I have got a five man unit of uh, Terminators, all with Storm Bolters. I have got a five man unit of Devastators, all with Plasma Cannons. Uh, and then I've got two Count them too. Redemptor Dreadnoughts, both with Macroplasma Incinerators. Uh, and then I have got a Land Raider Crusader kitted out uh, with a Hunter Killer Missile, uh, twin Assault Cannons, uh, and then uh, two sets of, of um, Hurricane Bolters and a Storm Bolter. <laughs> Just like kitted out with bolt guns. 
Uh, ground affected. Was, that was it. Ground affected. War Games News Radio. Yes. Ground Sorry. Affected. Sorry to interrupt your awesome thing. No problem. Ground affected made it. They uh, collaborated with us. They sent it to us, and I am just overjoyed and excited to use it in games. This is very um, awesome. Uh, it needs a name. It needs a really good name. Right now, it's called uh, Justice Eterna. Nice. Not bad. Not bad uh, name. And then I have a rhino, and the rhino's got a hunter killer missile on it and a storm bolt and a storm bolter. Uh, so that's going to be the list. And uh, I'm just ready to shoot stuff with bolt guns and smash things with my fist. You have two dreadnoughts. I have two dreadnoughts and a land raider. Very, very I'm angry. terrified, Steve. Very, very angry. <laughs> very, very, very angry. Okay, so in reserves you got Terminator uh, Squad. I have nothing in reserves. Oh, uh, we're in transports. So the Rhino the and the land raider, right. Denarth, la uh, Denarth plus uh, the Terminators are all inside the land raider. Yeah. And then uh, the five um, uh, Devastators are inside the Rhino. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I see the name right here. It's actually right here. Wrath of Creed. That's Wrath actually a pretty cool name. Wrath of Creed. Wrath of Creed. It. I kind of like that one. I love it. Yeah. Um, all right, so we're going to get to playing here. Um, we're going to play. Basically, deployment is kind of like this angle deployment. I can deploy on an angle here. I've got uh, reserves here. You're deployed. You're good to go. These are all obviously sneaking here so that hopefully you won't be able to shoot them. The point is so that they are hidden as well as I possibly can. Sure. And... Dude, you ready for this? I'm ready. I'm so very ready. Awesome. Are you guys ready for this? Oh, they had better be. All right. Cool. We didn't see your target. We need to know where your target is. Where's the sniper going? Yeah, um, where is the sniper going first? Because we're about to roll off to see who goes first. We're going to roll off right now. Here we go. What color did you pick? I just picked orange. Is that okay? All right. Oh, yeah. I yeah. can be the gray ones. Yep. Okay, here we go. Right, and here we go. I got a two for two. going first. All right. I'm going to see if I can go first. Five. It looks like I'm going first. Sir! It's a really good game, man. Steve, let's yeah, play! It's gonna be blast. I'm excited! All right, but we need to know where are the shots from the sniper going? Perhaps into the aberrants would be phenomenal. No, I, uh, I But you do have scout moves, I believe. I do have a scout move. Do so I want to if use you it? want to, I actually, yeah, mm. so. So you I, probably had to do that to see before we go first, but. Yeah, whatever. that's true. It, you, no, no, scout moves are usually after. Yes, uh, we are using the new GSD errata. So yes, we are. He so can no longer do like triple mortals yeah. on the big jackal unit. Yeah. Thank goodness, because it's silly. It was really fun. Yeah. Super duper. It was silly. really fun. Uh, yeah, they have Scout 9. We need an answer on where. Well, I can, it, we the can. Mortals the the are shot going. can come later. It comes at the end of any phase. Oh, at the end of any phase? Yeah. Oh, okay. So. Away you go. Um, okay, so I'm going to take my free Scout 9, and I'm going to scout up here. Sure. Sorry, I have to make noises. It's, it's You have to make noises? It's in my noises. contract. It's a mutt? Is it? Yeah. Did Tack actually put that in the contract? He was shaking his head the whole I time. I strongly but, yeah. hope that's not true. <laughs> uh, we've got one shot on... Uh, Ooh, we have one shot from the sniper so far. <laughs> one whole shot. <laughs> Tell Nick, I wish him good luck. Thank you, Chills. All right, let's do it. Mm. Uh, go, Steve. Go, Steve, go. Go, Steve, go. Okay, so uh, for command step, uh, each of us gain a command point. Yep. I'm loving every minute of it. And then I am going to select uh, the Gene Stealer Squad as, your oath as of my oath of moment. That's what I'm going to select for. Um, and then I'm just going to take a quick look around the table to see what I can and cannot see. And, You're not going to get a lot of shots on that uh, Gene Steel Squad. No, but that's okay. Um, also, in my command phase, uh, this unit of intercessors right here stickies this objective. So even if I walk away from it, I still hold this I love that ability until you yeah. take it away from me. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I'm not going to get lots of shots, that's for sure. Uh, but that's okay. I'm not, uh, is this guy actually here? What is this? Uh, oh, sorry, that's my Sanctus that I didn't take in the army. Okay, great. He was sneaky. Oh, uh, yes. I was thinking of taking him, but I did not Alrighty, take him in the army. here we go. It's the summer break of Steve. The summer break of Steve. Okay, so All right. I'm not gonna get lost. Shoot the GSC tank. Yeah, <laughs> do it, shoot the GSC tank. And I can't move within nine of these bad boys, so I don't want to. I'm just gonna move up here. Why so can't you move within nine? Uh, because if I move within nine, you get a normal. Move. Oh, that's true. You get a normal move, and I don't want that. That's true. That's true. I'm gonna be able to shoot here, which will feel great. Um, to be clear, that's only if I have the attached unit to it. But which you do. Have I do the have the attached, attached unit. To it. Yeah. So you, yeah. 
Yes. So yes. Is what yes. What you say? What I'm saying is yes. Uh, oh no, it's just. Oh, Outrider gangs. No, they have nothing about that. There's nothing that they can move. You can move with a nine. Mm, what's their ability? Yeah, there's nothing, nothing about it. They, they do the demo run and the Outrider gang, which is each time you use the cult ability, you have to be deployed within six inches. Yeah, they have nothing about. You can be with a nine. There's no problem. What's the thing that lets them move again? Um, it's uh, this the sniper here. Yeah. After she shoots, you can move again. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I don't want that to happen because if you end a normal move, you mortal stuff. Yeah. I'm gonna basically move, shoot, and then more. But, but I don't want you to mortal now. Oh yeah. That's okay. what I'm saying. Okay. I don't want you to do. I it think right I understand now, what you're saying. Right? Like I. I it can only happen in my be... phase. My shooting phase. That's fine. Yeah. I don't want it to happen in my movement okay. phase. Okay. Got That's it. That's what I don't want. In my movement phase. My movement phase. I don't want it to happen right now. That's what I don't want. That's what I don't want. <laughs> uh, oh, and I this guy gets plus one to hit. Uh, <laughs> the little kid's lunchbox to, to make a dice tray? <laughs> oh, here they come. Here they come. Those dreadnoughts are freaky scary. Very scary. So very scary. That's okay. I'm all right with it. All um, right, just looking up those sure. rules there. What's up, Tego? Uh, cool. Which is good luck. Yeah. Ooh. He's putting the first shot. Oh, he's, why is he? Oh, fantastic. Oh, we missed it on the screen. I'm sorry, sorry. Into the Land Raider. Good luck from Cool. Thank you, Tycho. This is pretty cool. Your weathering is coming along, Rad. Steve. Too bad Rad. it's gonna blow up. No. Uh, all right, so that is the end of my movement phase. Yeah. Uh, so uh, what happens here? Do you want to do the honors? Yes, the I would. The sniper now shoots. Now, sniper just shoots. This is how we uh, support our channel a little bit here. Uh, it allows you to partake in the game. Basically, every time we get to up to fifty dollars in super chats, uh, combined from different chats and stuff like that. Yeah. The sniper shoots. Oh yeah, even I higher. Right. That extra. Excellent! He can shoot at any target on the board, and it's chosen by you guys, and you guys chose the Land, Land Raider. Raider! Automatically hits, wounds on a 2, because it has anti-everything too. It, it wounds! D3 Mortals! And it has D3 Mortal Wounds! What? One. <laughs> what? Singular Mortal Wounds. Ding! Ding! Thank you! Feels good, alright. All right. Excellent! Sounds good. Uh, so good start. Singular, 15 wounds remaining. Excellent start. It's a good start. It's helping you out. you guys. Thank you. Oh, we're gonna have a, we're gonna have a big blast. It's gonna feel good. Alrighty, so uh, here's what's going to happen for Who painted Imperial Fist? This guy. I did. I painted the Imperial Fist. I painted my Gene Steelers. You painted Imperial Fist. Uh, so uh, here's what's going to happen first. I'm going to go to my shooting phase. Uh, the Land Raider is going to shoot your Gene Steelers. These guys in the middle here. Yeah, into there. Oh, you can see them. You can totally see them, yep. Ah, oh, uh, man. I'm not going to be in rapid fire, I don't think, uh, which is which is just acceptable. I'm just going to have to Ah, oh, just dropping things. That's not great. Doesn't feel um, good. Unfortunately, I'm gonna spend a command point, and as you target them, because they're outside of 12 inches, you will not be able to target them. They get they gain oh. essentially lone operative and and uh, yeah, oh, and okay. stealth. That sucks. It's awesome. Uh, so I can shoot other things. You now can choose a different target if you have one. Okay. Yes. Does it have another target? Can you do a quick check for mm. me? I don't think so. I know it doesn't look like it. Nope. Uh, well, oh, you can fire down here. You can fire at these aberrants if you're in range. They uh, are 24 inches away. 24, yeah, I can shoot them. And so I will. I'll shoot them. So I'm down to zero command points, uh, Owen. Woohoo! All right. Sounds good. Uh, so I'm not going to shoot my 100 killer missile because that seems silly. Uh, but uh, that is one with the darkness. One with the darkness. It's awesome. Uh, it's so but good. I do have. Uh, a twin linked hurricane bolter. Oh no, sorry. I have uh, two hurricane bolters, so I get 12 shots in total. As an IF painter, you gotta share the yellow paint tricks. How do you do it? With patience and spite. Yellow rattle can. <laughs> With patience and spite. And a yellow rattle can. And a yellow rattle can. <laughs> uh, you know what, honestly, like, it's just never a paintbrush. Whatever you decide to do, it's never a paintbrush. <laughs> uh, so on threes. Uh, no sweet, sweet rerolls because they are not, not your own target. target. Cause you chose uh, these. And their toughness what? They are toughness five. five. So on fives, rerolling. 
Top is five. Uh, top is six. Top is six. Top is still on five to be rolling. Because these are twin links. Yeah. Uh, so uh, four so far, and then uh, the assault cannon on threes, and then uh, and then on fours you're rolling. All of them. That is uh, devastating. So. Uh, five wounds, AP nothing, okay. and then two mortal wounds. All right, do I, uh, do, would I have cover from this? Oh, sorry, not quite. I s yeah, you'll have cover. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no, that's it. So five wounds, AP nothing. Okay. So you just get whatever your save is. Uh, plus cover, right? No. No? Well, I'm behind it, aren't I? AP nothing, so it doesn't matter. nothing, but I still get cover. Okay. <laughs> but well, it would improve my save by one. It does not do anything of the sort. Cover doesn't reduce your AP. It oh, right, sorry, I think of Marines. <laughs> I don't, you Adam! can't go. I, hey, Nick, this time I won't shoot you. This is gonna be one of the Dreadnought. <gasps> Adam, you are amazing. I'm gonna put this dice right here to know that I get to shoot it at the Dreadnought. Thank you, Adam, I appreciate that. Aww. All right, so on fours for the Aberrants. I'm thinking you can't get the two up. Yeah. That's what you can't get. Yeah, so that's three saves. Two sure. go through, how much damage? You have a four up funeral pain, don't you? I do have four up Yeah, just one. But one damage each. Okay, four up feeling the pains. First one saved. Second one fails. It goes through. Sounds good. And then two mortals. Four up feeling the pains. And then two four uh, feeling the pains for the two mortals. Oh, I feel them both. You've killed an aberrant. I did. Ah, that's really surprising. They have actually, two wounds only. They have three wounds. Oh, they have three. Wounds. But I failed another one before. Oh, okay. So you've Got killed it. one of the aberrants. Sweet. I, I was expecting that not to happen. Okay. All right. What's next? Ha 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 ha! Thank you, Adam. I appreciate that. Um, previous games, Adam has almost se severely designated me and just like totally annihilated my guys. Sick. <laughs> uh, all right, cool. So then, what's going to happen is uh, my uh, Devastator squad is going to shoot at the uh, is going to shoot at your Gene Sealers. Not a problem. Because of that strategy I spent earlier, they still have stealth. Yeah, the minus yeah. one to hit. You are within 12 inches, so you, st you obviously can't I can still can do it. I can still you do it. You just barely. I can still do it. Yeah. I can still do it. How many uh, are actually in there? 11? Uh, there right should now? be 10 guys. Oh, the 11. 11? Yeah. Right. 11 plus the Primarch. Sounds good. Uh, Patriarch, sorry. Patriarch. Not a Primarch. I don't have Primarchs. Oh, yeah. Uh, alrighty, so it's uh, 2d3 plus 8 shots. Sorry, th uh, 4d3 plus 8 shots. Uh, so three, four, five, six, seven, oh. eight. So sixteen shots in total. That's, that's a lot eight, of shots. Twelve. This could be bad. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And just a reminder: minus one to hit for stealth. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, so I'm on fives now and f on full rerolls. Not great. Ooh. Let's continue that trend. No rerolls. Rerolls fail. Rerolls no. fail. Rerolls don't fail. Re Chat with me. Don't fail. Chat. Chant with me. Re rolls fail. Re rolls fail. No way. <laughs> but it definitely. Adam, make another one, Nick. Oh, I've got two. Oh, Adam, you are a saint, sir. I appreciate that. So if you're just joining us, Adam has just donated um, fifty dollars. Every time we get to fifty dollars, oh, and with that ten dollars, so that we're thirty dollars away from another another uh, um, a sniper chat. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Always fun. Uh, does that pull us over? Yep. Okay, so we're actually at three, three, three shots. Uh, Tian, all our always fun. Oh, uh, first blood for the Imperials. Choose where that goes uh, because you did that one. So, uh, oh, that's two shots for me. Ooh, thank you guys. Uh, if you're just joining us, uh, super chats, fire the sniper. You guys get to take part of the game. How many? Do, how many wounds am I taking on the? Uh, so seven AP minus two. That's from these guys on yeah. here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now they have a five up invulnerable save. Okay. Um, because they have a five up save normally, it would go to yeah. four, but doesn't matter. Sounds good. Invulnerable save saves two. You've killed one, two, three, four, five. No, they have two wounds each now. Oh, they have two, what? They have two wounds apiece? Right. Oh, two wounds apiece. then I will, I would have overcharged. Oh, okay, it. sorry. Sorry, so you just, it's AP minus three, but you five yeah. of them go. Okay, so, um, yeah, so five, five are, wow, that's pretty good. Okay, five, and then, five uh, are dead, and then take hazardous tests. Uh, yeah, so hazardous, uh, I don't lose any. Nyrr. Good to go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, oh yeah. Get out of here. Uh, and then the uh, the rhino's gonna shoot at them as well. Uh, so on fours, re-rolling. Because of your stealth. Uh, nothing. 
And then on. Um, actually, you need to check the rhino. Is he within 12 now? Because I've taken guys off. And it's a newer unit, and I have can't shoot me within 12. Yes. Okay. I was within 12. Good. Uh, so uh, one AP nothing. One AP nothing. Save it. You're good. Excellent. Okay. Cool. Uh, alrighty. And then uh, the this dreadnought here is gonna shoot its. Uh, the only weapon that's going to have range to those neophytes or whatever they're called, the initiates yeah. uh, here that are sitting right here, mm -hmm. those guys. Uh, so the dreadnought here is going to shoot its macroplasma incinerator down at them. Mm. Mm -hmm. This one over here. So how many? You, uh, no, no, the one in the back. One, Sorry, one, the one in the front. One in the front. Got it. Yeah. So how many? Um, how many guys are in that unit? Uh, there's ten. Unit ten. Is a unit of ten. Okay, yep. great. Uh, so it's uh, D6 plus three shots now. Oh, you know what you forgot to do at the beginning of your turn? Draw oh. your secondaries. Oh yeah, good call. <laughs> Good gracious, this is so badly wanted to kill you. <laughs> You're just so excited to kill uh, me. Investigate signals behind enemy lines. So behind uh, enemy lines is get guides in my deployment zone. Investigate yeah. signals is do actions in corners. So I'm not gonna be able to do the behind enemy lines, but may I just, adjust those? Yes. I'll just move the um, And these the guys end. are within nine here, so just don't shoot with yeah. these guys. Nice and easy. There you go. Yeah. Uh, so the, the two intercessor squads are going to accomplish investigate signals for two, and I won't be able to accomplish behind enemy lines, and that's okay. Yeah. You it's just have to accept okay it. to get one you can't do in the first turn because so you getting get that extra, extra C, command point CP is, a big is, deal. is actually really cool. Five, and then three. Uh, and then... There we go. Yeah. Uh, so on uh, threes... And then on... This is the Dreadnought fire. Yeah, and I'm imagining it's on two way back here. Uh, So, uh, four AP minus threes. Oh, I don't get to save. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, just three of them die. <laughs> yeah. He's, I think he said four. Oh, sorry. Four of them die. Yeah. I apologize. Uh, do you have anything else that can shoot them? I don't believe so, no. One, two, three, four. There you go. You killed mm a few. Okay. Oh, that, that's only one, two, three, four. Okay, rad. Uh, so uh, the end of my, that's the end of my turn, unfortunately. Uh, but that's all right. I think what's uh, going to happen here is I am going to just, I complete the investigate signals. Yep. I don't have anything that's going to be in line of sight and in range of anything. And so I have to just say go. So I score um four victory points for investigate signals at the end of my turn awesome uh, and then i'm gonna discard behind enemy lines for a command point going to two command points it's two command points and you've scored yeah. sorry three points what's sorry how many points did you score uh four four so four. total total four for him awesome i got four cool. and then because it's the end of the phase now all these sniper shots go off and yeah. uh did we see what um he shot at 10th is definitely the year of Steve. Glad to see the man himself is back in the studio. Hope Heck you're doing yeah. well. yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Northern. Northern all the way. All right. Uh, we never saw the other shot where the sniper's going. So we've got sniper shot. So if you're just joining us, he say, you know, for instance, Riley said he'd never caught guys live. Uh, we won't tell your boss. Don't worry. Especially because I don't know who your boss is. <laughs> but we have an ability for you guys to pick part of the game. It also helps support the channel as a fundraiser. Whenever we come to a total of $50 in Super Chat donations, yeah. the sniper fires at a target of your choice. And uh, so now we've got three shots to make. Two of them are going into the Dreadnought because they were given to me by Adam. Thank you so much, Oh, Adam. boy. And one of them is still being targeted. So we don't know where that one is going. So get back to us right now. People um, are saying, you got this, Steve, but you really got to target the Gene Stealer stuff for me to get this. <laughs> All right. Nick had a haircut. I did. It was... Yes. Whoa. Um, I think they want another... Into the Dread... Uh, uh, yeah. Yes? Okay. I'd be okay with that. Let's do this so two for now. three of them into the Dreadnought? First of all, two of them into the Dreadnought. Uh, they wound twice. D3 mortal wounds for each Those one. Two D3 mortals. It auto wounds on a two. Does armor of contempt? Ha yeah, it does. Sure. Armor of contempt stops this. It, it doesn't really. Oh, sorry, not armor of contempt. Um, uh, duty eternal. It's it, minus one damage. Sure, because it's devastating wounds. I mean, so it's minus one. Yeah, Why not? I'm pretty sure it does. For this, we'll say so, because otherwise, six damage on the dreadnought. That's pretty rough. Well, it is, but I, I actually think that is how it works. Uh, so I would take four points in total <laughs> to the dread. Uh, four, four damage in total to the Dread, yeah. and then we have one more shot, then we need to know where it's going. We need to know where it's going. Do you always score VP on the first turn? You don't on primary, you do on secondary. Yeah. All right, well, I guess it's going to the Dreadnought. Yep, that's that. Yay, Dreadnought! It hits against the Dreadnought! It wounds against the Dreadnought and does... Another three more wounds. So it goes down to I six. just did 369. 
which goes down to two, four, six. six. So there's six wounds remaining. Oh, I'm not. totally okay with that. Alrighty, that good turn. I bet it was. It all went to me. Yeah, that's fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Alrighty, here um, we go. Okay, so on my turn, I'm gonna start by drawing some secondaries here. Okay. Uh, and get a command point. So I'm up to one. Sounds you're good. up. You're at three now. Yeah, I'm at three now. Um, so behind enemy lines, get stuff in your deployment zone. I actually can do that. Yep. Um, and capture enemy outpost. Take an objective. Uh, control one or more objective markers in your opponent's deployment zone. So that's that one way back there. Yeah. Ooh, I can advance and charge with the Gene Stealers. Oh, that's a long charge. I could risk it to try to get it. Is this in your deployment zone? No, no. It just, is not. So just that the one deployment back there. zone actually starts like right so here, here and just goes that one back, back there. In that. Yeah, we each only have one. If I risked zone. it hard, I could go take your home objective. If you risk it hard. <sighs> get in there. Go See, for it. The, one, the reason to try to do this one is it's worth eight points. It's yeah. one of the highest scoring secondaries yeah. in the game. Uh, oh, thank you, Lord Rahul. Um, gift of membership. How many memberships was that donated? Five. five? five. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that counts towards the That's total. Awesome. Yeah. That counts yeah. towards the total. Um, yeah. Uh, what does that mean? Twenty-five. That was twenty-five. Twenty-five. Okay, so we're, we're twenty-five dollars away from another sniper shot. Well, Hopefully so much, going guys. to Nick. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully going to Nick. <laughs> it is Owen on the chat and the um, and the uh, switching. So thank you so much, I, Owen. I got a question. Does this does the sniper have the precision shot that it does have? Uh, the shield breaker shot? No, 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 no. Like, its gun has precision. Yeah. When it like right now, it's all it's doing is picking at vehicles. But like, I let's say it, it shot. I think it, it doesn't have precision. You think it doesn't have? I, th I think okay. it should not have precision. Otherwise, we're gonna pick another character. Because you've too got quickly. lots of characters around. Right well, now. you got characters too. I do, yeah. But not as many. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, <sighs> the round is chambered. Attack is right. In membership right now, there's early access to Steven Box playing Ultra Marines versus Admech. Right. Which is, I've heard it was a great game. That so is actually a great thing to If you to have talk just about. been gifted membership or. Yes. Oh, Lord Rule. Oh, actually, with those, with those fly play on table drop memberships, oh, you've just yeah. pushed us over. Round is chambered. Um, Lord Rule. Lord Rule, where's that going? Where's it going? To and for those of you. Perhaps. To, to those of you who just joined our membership, check out the exclusive content that just got uploaded. There's an early access, as we said, yep. against Steven Box. Box? I keep box. saying Box. You keep saying Vox. Yes. It's not. I mean, it works. Um, Let's get that sniper shot going, but Oh, where? cool! Thank you! Another one. I don't want to destroy the tank, but I think Steve needs some love. So this one's for Steve. Yeah. Um, all right. So we'll, we'll put a Steve shot. So we still need Lord Rahul. Oh, sorry. L Lord Rahul, where's the sniper going? Um, so that's going in. That'll go in at the end of the next phase here. So that'll be end of the command phase. Yeah. Um, but there is some great exclusive stuff. There's yeah. a, uh, early access it's and really good. The, the the part one of our two part uh, campaign between me and Moven is up there right now. Yeah, and with number two rad. coming out really really it's soon. Really awesome. Might might even be today if we can get it done. Um, okay, so I gotta choose. What well, I'm gonna do these? I'm not gonna discard any. Yep. So in the movement phase, I really gotta figure out: Am I gonna go for that back objective? That is a hard decision. Because yeah. I think I can almost guarantee I can move up here and probably wipe out that entire Devastator squadron. Maybe. I'm pretty confident about that. Maybe. Um, oof. When is the Space Marine Steve versus Steven Box Mega match? Soon. Soon. All right. I think it's greedy Lord to go Rule. for the back. Where is it going? I think Where? it's I think it's greedy to go for the back, and I don't think I can make it, Steve. You sure? Yeah, I don't I think, think you can. I don't it. think I can make it to the back. I think you can do it. Because but eight, nine, ten, eleven on average of three. We have shots that have to happen before your command steps. Yeah. Over so that would be a ten inch charge. I can't do it. All right, so I'm going to advance uh, closer to those Devastator with these uh, Gene Steelers. Sounds good. It's eight, nine, uh, nine, Hold 12. on, so, all right, well, while so we- So advancing? Well, stop, no, stop. You, we, we have to do these first. And right, we steps. do! Thank you. In all right. the command step. In the command step. So Rahul, we still need to work going, but we'll fire the one. Um, I'm gonna fire it into, I guess, we'll, uh, we'll uh, die and it will tell the cause of the shit. All right, so all Lord right. Rahul's, so, uh, uh, one, two, three, and four. One, so in that corner, so it would be one of my units. All right. Uh, so in that quadrant, there are, I'll say this guy's probably in this quadrant. I want to damage the so land raider. One, two, three, well, do it at random if you want to right. random. Okay, one, one two, three, two, three four. four. Okay. Uh, all the dreadnought, that's damaged. All right, here we go. <laughs> uh, For another three. Oh, no. Rough stuff. <laughs> oh, Rough Chris stuff. Lee, hey, where do Chaos Marines shop for groceries? Trader's Joe's. 
Hilarious. That's not bad. Hilarious. Thank you, Chris Lee. And then, uh, so the other one, where was the other one? Um, uh, that was for me, wasn't it? That was for you to choose, wherever oh, you want. Oh, sick, all right. That was from Adam. Gene Steelers it is. All right. All right, on two up. Does it. D3 right. Mortals. Oh, come on, D3 Mortals for one, one. mortal. <laughs> all right, so this one over here is down to one wound. Okay. All right, so and then me. I already rolled a four for my advance. Eight, mm -hmm. nine, 10, 11, 12. So uh, I'm, I'm going to spend one command point. Yep, for And I'm going to overwatch them with the Devastators. Before I move or after I move? Uh, before you move, I guess. Okay. It doesn't really matter. Well, uh, I got cover now. If you wait till after, I don't have cover. I don't it really matters. Free anyway, yeah. So, right. uh, so uh, the bolt gun will go first. Uh, so on sixes, re rolling. Nope. And then uh, 4d3 shots, all plus one. That's so these guys overwatching four. at the. Mm -hmm. So three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen 10, 11, 12, 13 shots. Are you overcharging? Uh, yeah, I'm overcharging. Nice. Awesome. Eight. All right, on. Six is re-rolling. Come on. Oh, yeah, there's four of them in there. That's rad. There we go. Six is five of them in there. All right. Okay, okay. Five shots. Five and then on twos. Do right. we right. go twos? They do, yeah. You're T4, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. So uh, five AP minus threes, all two Oof. damage. Five, five ups. Yep, here Let's we go. some gene sealers. No. I say one, you killed four, four more. more. That was an effective use of Overwatch. Yeah, was it worth it? Did you a couple? Nope. <sighs> yeah. Good Overwatch, Dude. boys. Dude. Good Overwatch, boys. They're way less scary now. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. I have way too many Gene Steelers here, I'm sorry. Oh. I, sh I only actually have one, one left. Oh, you okay. killed five last turn. Yeah. I yeah, I was cheating there. Oh, cheating! <laughs> just, just some casual cheating. Wow! No at all. So you've killed it down to one gene stealer and the patriarch. <laughs> well yeah. done. Yeah. Can you now move them twelve inches? Can I move these guys twelve inches? Yeah. You want to go up this way? Yeah, just right in front. They're yeah, right gonna go kill the, those guys. Right in front of the devastators. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're gonna try. I guess. Sounds good. I, w I was hopeful to try with what six. Oh yeah. I don't think I could do it with two. no go. Yeah. Frick. None of that. Um, okay. <laughs> um, my aberrants are going to move up, yep. and they're going to move up and hold this objective. Sounds good to me. Um, in fact, they're going to advance because they got nothing else to do. All right. Yeah, they got a bit more to move. Here we go. I'm just going to hide. Get them in best there. Best we can. Get them in there. Well, not being seeable through that target. Um, hmm. Hmm. Lots of choices to make here, sir. Um, Lehman Ross Battle Tank is gonna move up. And I kill my own guys. Ooh, Scratch Anvil, what's everyone's hopes for their armies in the coming years? I want Votan to have a Dreadnought of some That would be actually cool, like a war suit kind of thing. Yeah, I could, see, I could see it being like, a, almost like a pseudo, like Dread Knight from uh, Grey Knights. Oh yeah, you can actually like that. see the guy I can see up that. front. Yeah. I can see that very well. Um, oh, summon the cult. I forgot to summon the cult. I get, don't know what that means. I get guys back. Oh. I get lots of guys back. Three guys? Uh, six, six guys. I believe it's all six. Yeah. The um, beginning of your hundreds and hundreds of points of free stuff. <laughs> yeah, the unit's at full now. Yeah, that's fine. Boop, 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 boop. What else is going on in chat right now? Uh, hmm. Anyone else get dreadnoughts? Why not the space force? Exactly. Mm -hmm. So the Rogal door needs to go somewhere. Yep. But I'm not sure if I should go here and double down on there. It's just that you've got all your anti-tank stuff there. Yeah. You like open it right up, don't you? You have no deep strikers. No. No deep strikers. None of that. Don't need it, don't want it. All right, Rogal Dorn's going to go. Yeah, right up there. Look at it go. And then it's going to go. Whoa. <laughs> Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> so cool. It's so freaking cool. Um, and then it's what I'm going to do with my drive by demolitions from my bikes. Yeah. Oh, and my saboteur. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> um, can you move me forward? So I'm still holding the objective? Sure. 
So I, uh, so I just need, to, I'm trying to be within eight of those infantry. Is that, is that true? Am I within eight? Uh, yep. Okay, great. Because he can use the, she can use the grenade stratagem for free. Oh, cool. Which is great. Love it. Love and it. then these guys will go woof, nice and fast. This is what you should have used the Overwatch on. No. No, you don't think so? No. They're not owed, so what's the point? We should have owed them. Why? I couldn't shoot them with anything. Uh, I guess that's true. Right. All right, fair point. Plus allowing like a 12 or 11 gene stealers, one of them being a patriarch to just like have, like I have, oh, I they would have, have opening. They would, minced, they would have minced that yeah. unit, that's I had true. A, and they're not battle line, right? So they come back only on a four up? Yeah. Yeah, and the character never comes back with Yeah, the character doesn't around, come back. So. Yeah. so if I kill it, I'm feeling okay. Yeah. All right, all right. Um, hmm. <laughs> Okay, so as I move close to you, I get to launch all my bombs with drive-by demolitions. Oh yeah. So, I get to use this as much as I wanted to. Um, each time this unit ends a normal move, yep. you can select one enemy unit within six inches, and visible to this unit, and roll 1d6 for each model in this unit. Yep. For each four up, the enemy suffers one mortal wound. Here we go. So I have 10 guys. You betcha. Let's do oh, 10 four ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. So ten. every four up is a mortal wound to uh, that tank. No, there should be eleven in there. Oh, right. There's eleven. Oh, because the character, right? right? The character, right? Oh, yeah, that's true. Thank yep. you for that. Yeah, no problem. Appreciate that. Ah, uh, boom! One, two, three, four, five, six mortal wounds. Woo! Woo All right. Nine wounds remaining. Fan frickin' tastic. Yeah. Now, before the fact. What would happen right now is that I would then use the sniper's ability to do a free move, which would give me an initial, yeah. <laughs> another one. So silly, added. absolutely and not. Imagine doing another six mortal wounds. Absolutely just like brutal. Not. Absolutely not. Tien, always fun. Thank you so much. Are always fun. Uh, thank you so much for the donations. And uh, I'm yeah, gonna... of course, thank yeah. you so much. It helps us keep this place Wait, powered up. Wait, is that Rahul? I see. I saw Lord Rahul. That's not like Rahul to Marine, is it? I feel like Rahulcher Marine would have just changed his name to Rahulcher Marine. Changed his name to Rahulcher Marine. But, <laughs> I mean, it might be. It's hard to say. If so, hi. <laughs> um, okay. So but that's that, that's the movement phase. We have no more sniper shots because TN always fun. Take us really close, but we're not quite there yet. Every fifty dollars brings us to a sniper shot. Um, so a time to shooting. A time for shooting. Excellent. Um, Yep, that is a Lehman Rust you're pointing <laughs> at. Lehman Rust. <laughs> Lehman Rust is gonna fire into the... So the Dreadnought has four wounds remaining? The Dreadnought has got four wounds remaining, yeah. Let's try to kill the Dreadnought. Trying to take it right out. Oh, or do I kill this? Oh. So many that Land Raider needs so to die, time. but I can't really do anything about it this turn. That's the problem. Boy, oh boy. Um, yeah, I'm gonna choose to kill something. Which, it, uh, but the hurricane bolters are so freaking awesome. Yep. Everything from the uh, from the uh, Lehman Russ into the Land Raider. Sounds good to me. Uh, right. So I am going to. Ooh, stratagem. Double check. Amphrosia! $20? Woo Ooh, good right. luck. Have fun to both of you. Thank you for getting me into Thank the Grim Dark so game. Do you have anyone that plays Eldari? I would love to see my main army in the channel. Uh, we do. JT plays Eldari. We have yep. a combat patrol from JT coming out soonish. Yeah. Um, I've played Eldari a couple times. Uh, we have a, like a ghost army. You're not really a. I'm yeah, not really an Eldari player, player, but I have enjoyed it. So I might try. We can find some Eldari I, players. I gave Steve the option of playing against Eldari for this one. Yeah. And Steve said, I was like, nah, I'm OK. <laughs> <laughs> However, like the, the options were not phenomenal. It was like, would you like to play against Eldar, one of the best armies in the game? Or GSC, the best army in the game? Hmm. I don't know, Nick. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to spend one command point, uh, and I'm going to smoke my Land Raider. That makes a lot of sense. Minus one to hit. So you go from hitting on fours to hitting on fives. Fives? Yep. yep. All right, D6 plus three shots. Oh, it actually does that hit on fours or does it hit it on threes? It on fours normally. Oh, okay. Yeah. You sure? Yeah. You positive? Yeah, rerolls oh. ones because it's a Lehman Ross. Oh, okay. Um, anyways, uh, four, five, six, seven shots. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, uh, you use a tank commander to get on hit on threes. Oh, the tank commander. I do not have any tank commanders because I'm a GSC army. It's a regular, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it. Um, whoa, I did excellent! Look at that! It's like all sixes. I, I, do, I really wish I had the Born Soldiers rule, but yeah, one, two, no three, way. four. 
Uh, four hits. Yep. Uh, strength of nine, I believe, with the main battle cannon. Sweet. So, uh, toughness 12, wounding me on fives. Uh, main battle cannon, I gotta double check that. Strength 10! Still wounding me on fives. Yeah. What is your toughness, like 12? 12, yeah. Yeah. Two wounds! What is Fantastic. the AP of Minus this bad one. Boy? Minus one. Uh, what that means is that I, uh... Give me one sec. Give me one sec. Give me one sec. Give me one sec. <laughs> and I just look at that. I have to look. We rely on guests to add more variety unless you're Nick who plays everything. Well, not everything, I try. Uh, the problem is I wanna be competent in everything. I don't need to win, but I wanna feel like I'm competent in giving the viewers an army that isn't, isn't, uh, it makes, makes sense for it, right? No, yeah. You trying to figure it out? Adros, hey Nick, going to pick up a Talos next week, going to make the skin blue to remove uh, the ta Oh, come on! All right, you so, don't need to do that. You don't need to do that. Uh, you don't smoke, need to do that. Uh, smoke stream gives me <laughs> uh, stealth, so minus one to hit, but also gives me the benefit of cover. Uh, <laughs> so I'm back on my two up. Good to go. Oh, okay, fine. And then the last cannon. Misses. Woohoo! All right. Excellent. And because I was an idiot and didn't put sponsons on it, because Look at that. now they're free. Now they're free. <laughs> Hunter Killer Missile. Wait, do they have Hunter Killer? Yeah, they do. One shot. Might as well shoot it. Misses. That is too bad. It's too, it is too bad. That is just too bad. All right. Um, Are you sure it misses? Hunter Killer Missiles usually hit on two. Does it hit on Hunter Killer Missiles has a four. Oh, it has on yours. Hits on You're fours. thinking of Space Marines. And yeah, mine hits on a two. You're thinking of Space Marines. That is just too bad. <laughs> that is just um, too bad. The uh, saboteur over there, that is right here, is going to use the grenade stratagem for oh, zero Oh, yeah, he will. And it's going to shoot the grenade at those uh, those uh, guys there. Sounds good to me. It's an amazing stratagem. Six it's dice. Incredible. Four ups. Mortal wounds. Oh, 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 oh. This is all of them. <laughs> Five. Almost a clean sweep. Got Five it. Five mortal wounds. I killed Almost a clean two to sweep. Woohoo! Rough stuff. Woohoo! Lost two dudes. One guy still got a wound. Good job, saboteur. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good. Um, okay. Um, then we're going to Chris Lee. Steve goes to the doctor and pleads, Doctor, Doctor, I keep rolling ones. Can you do anything to help me? And the doctor replies, No, no dice. dice. Rough. <laughs> that actually puts us five dollars away from the cool. next sniper shot. So if you're interested yeah. in supporting the channel and getting a chance to target the sniper somewhere, you know where to go. All right, uh, let's continue it on. Um, Rogel Dorn is not going to fire. Yep. Um, I don't think I can see the Lehman Russ. No. Um, so. <sighs> the... I am Devastators. 20 forces away, so all yep. the heavy bolters are going to go into the the Devastators. Sounds good. In addition, um, this is equipped with the the big giant uh, uh, the Castigator Gatling Cannon. Love it. At 24 inches, so that's also going to go into the Devastators. My, my. But the big giant Twin Battle Cannon, I'm thinking, might be better off targeting that Rhino. All right, sounds good. So, uh, and the rest of his guns are out of range, because those are... Heavy stubbers in there? Yeah. No, those are melted guns, aren't they? I can't tell, actually. Uh, I believe that those are melted. Yeah, yeah those are melted. Melted are only 12 inches, so they're out of range. Out of range. So, big giant twin battle cannon. Here we into, go. Into uh, the, the, the Rhino. Very, very plus three angry. shots. Two, three, four, five shots. One, Woo. two, three, four, five shots. Hitting on fours. Whoosh. Only hit once. Ooh, very rough. Wounding. Yeah, it's a wounding. AP? Uh, AP minus one. Minus one, so it goes to a uh, four up save. And I'm good to go. All right, and then the heavy bolters, I've got two of them. Yep. Um, one, two, three, six. Uh, hits you four times. Sounds good. Strength of five. I love it. Wounding on threes, three wounds. Three whole wounds. Minus one. Three whole wounds, minus one, into the Devastators, right? Yep, into the Devastators. Sounds good, four ups. Here to there. Uh, I lose one and damage another, so one of them dies, one of them takes the wound. Excellent. Death. And then the Castigator Gatling Cannon. Here we go. Which is 12 shots. Loving it. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I could kill you right here. Hoorah! How, how much is a sniper shot? Every time we get to $50 it's a sniper shot, we are $5 away from a sniper shot happening. Steve has, sorry, uh, Steve, have you ever tried the Apothecary and Hellblaster combo? You better believe it. Yeah, I have. I've tried it. I actually really like it with the three, lieutenant. Four. Because the lieutenant gives them lethal hits, so they four can no really angrily wound things that are usually above their weight category, which is awesome. 
Four mortals, you say? Four no minus. Oh, no minus into that, yep. right? And Dil Dilgaff, mechanic, wants to give Whoa. you help and has donated Gosh. that last $5. I so there's it. a sniper shot coming. Yeah. Steve gets a choice of a sniper, unless Dilgaff, you'd like to choose a target. All right. Um, so you're down to one left. And cool! Similar to Amphrosia's uh, SC, my army, oh, and Adam pulls another God. shot to the Dreadnought. Okay, so All that's right. happening at the end of the phase, and at, uh, and rolls another one! Oh, yeah! So, Ooh. Reinhardt, tell us where that shot's going. So there's another shot queued up, but we don't know where that's going yet. So I've got one of the Dreadnought, and you've got a choice. Yeah, one Ooh, I've got a choice. Look at that, thank All you guys. Right. That's uh, happening at the end of the phase, so we don't yeah. interrupt what's going on right now. Yeah. So you're down to one Marine left there from the, the, oppress the Gatling Cannon. I think those Gene Stills can take off that one. Maybe. All right. Ron uh, Hart, I hear your question, but I'm going to wait for him to stop talking to answer it. Keep going. I got one thing left to shoot, and that is all of these guys. Love it. And they're going to shoot everything into uh, this unit right here. Uh, what's the AP on their weapon? Nothing. Oh, sweet. Got a bunch of flamers and, and, I feel and right shotguns. About it. Love it. You're totally fine. Totally fine. Um, yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm going to be just fine. Oh, I did this in the wrong order. Oh, I did okay. this in the wrong order. Okay, so basically, this person can do the grenade stratagem for free. Uh, yes. But they can but only do it can. if it's second. It. Because I would have to, so I'm not, I'm, we're not gonna do it. I didn't do it right. Basically, these guys have the grenade keyword. I could have uh, shot yeah. a grenade here. Yeah. Um, and, and then. And on the land raider, done a bunch of damage. And then yeah. I could have done it for free over there. But you can't. You can't. No, you did it the wrong way around. Did it the wrong way around. Did it the wrong way around. Um, Speaking of, actually, the saboteur actually hasn't shot yet. It just did the grenade stratagem. So I'm going to shoot right now with it. And uh, that is going to be, um... oh, it's another one. Ooh. Zegek, no sniper, sh no sniper shot. How about Steve gets to treat ones as sixes for a single roll? Yeah, OK, sure. <laughs> Done. All right, uh, let's, put a, that. let's put a token beside you, to uh, a token to know that you can do that one time. Sick. Choose the time when you get to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Put that in my pocket. I'm gonna uh, need it. What are we doing to the uh, Dirty Combat Troll? Very soon. Steve, uh, JT played it against uh, Necrons. It was good. Um, so, we're gonna shoot the Demolition Charge. Uh, D6 plus three shots. Three, uh, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is hitting on twos. Nice. Um, all hits at one. This is strength 12? Wow, yeah, this yeah. really yes, good. There oh, is. No, this is a one shot. I don't want to use the one shot on this, on the one Marine. I apologize. Uh, can, right. Mind if I take that back? I didn't realize this is the one shot weapon. This thing that you're shooting? Yeah. He, yeah, uh, yeah. He, she has two different weapons. Yeah. She has a demolition charge, which is a one shot weapon. Yes. I want to save that for a tank oh, or something okay. like that. All right, sounds good. Okay, sorry about that. Um, so good. Remote explosives is her other gun. D6 plus three shots. So four shots in total. Yep. Um, into this, right? Hitting on threes. Yeah, into the Marine with one wound there. Hits them all. Um, uh, strength five, so wounding on threes. Wounds four, three times at no minus. Love it, three ups. And uh, yep, he dies. Killed him. All right. Blah. Now we're going to these guys, and they're all firing into these Marines. I've got yep. two flamers first. Oh, yeah. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Maybe three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine flamer shots. And one, two, three, four, uh, four wounds. Oh wait, is it heavy? Is that a heavy flamer? Uh, flamer is strength five, so it's actually five wounds. One, two, three, four, five at minus one for the incinerator. Into into these marines right here. Oh, you said it was minus nothing. Sorry, uh, the I apologize. The flamer is minus one. I just re just read that. I didn't realize that. Did you okay. want to do anything different? No, it's okay. So on uh, four, so I lose one and a bit, dudes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven for the small arms fire. They're just shooting all little shotguns. Sounds good. Pew, 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 pew. Hitting on fours. Not fantastic. Well, actually, that is fantastic. That's great. Um, small arms and uh, strength four. So on fours to wound. One, two, three, four. Four wounds, no minus. Four wounds, no um, minus. These Marines back here Sounds from good. these pistols. Uh, oh, I lose another guy. It's rough stuff. Oof, excellent. Oof, not and doing great. Last thing to shoot is the Jackal Elphus. The Jackal Elphus will shoot its sniper rifle. Might as well shoot it at these guys right here. Okay. Uh, sniper rifle into there. Hits on a three. Uh, that hits. Uh, strength five. 
That does not wound. No. That's too bad. No wound. Um, as soon as it makes an attack. Uh, Lord Rahul just puts a bunch of like ultramarine symbols. So is that ultra Rahul Rahul Marine? Is that Rahul Marine? Probably. <laughs> uh, Master Archer, after this model, this this model unit is shot. If it's not within engagement range, I can make a normal move of six inches as if it was the movement phase. Yeah. So I could move if I wanted to. However, then I can't charge. So what I'm going to do is I'm uh, I'm holding the objective right now. But you don't get to grenades. No. Off of that ability, right? Um, behind any lines, do I have to have two guys there? Yes, I believe so. If two or more units are there, um, how close are they to being in in deployment er, in deployment zone? Because if I make a good out. charge, they can end up in the deployment charge. Because yeah, I just totally charge around, right? Yeah. So to here, okay. So if I if I just make a good charge, I can jump around you. Correct. So okay. you need to make a charge that is better than a because you have to be wholly within. Yeah. Okay, so that means that you need to make a charge that is better yes, than... Is there. Hey, Andy. You, if you roll an eight or higher, you can get that whole unit into this okay. model. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to do the free charge in the hopes that I get a good charge there, and I'm going to try to charge these guys into these guys. Sounds good. All right, we're going to finish my phase, which means we have some sniper shots to do. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So one of them was into the Dreadnought. One of them was into the Dreadnought. Okay, so I'll yeah. fire that Dreadnought shot. Yep. Cup pow! Uh, it totally it does. Hits. D3 more. Oh, wait, this is a perfect time for. <laughs> Only one. Only one. Only one. I'm okay with it. I am okay. You're down with to it. how many wounds on that dreadnought? Three now. Three wounds on that dreadnought. Three. I love it. Now, you have a shot. I do have a shot, yeah. And we're still, we were still waiting for where this shot was going. Did we hear where that shot was going? <laughs> uh, all right, well, I am going to put that into your... Oh, the saboteur? Um, the saboteur. It's a good shot. Uh, um, yeah, because she only has three wounds. Yeah. You could kill her right here. And she does have the advantage. Yes, that's what this token is for, yeah. For once, yeah. Just wanted, uh, just wanted to know, like Amphrosia, before do anyone on Play on Temple Up play my second favorite army, Space Wolves, with the unit-specific characters? Yep, I do. I play them. I love them. You were it's, thinking about doing Space Wolves today, actually. I was thinking about doing Space Wolves today. I do wound you for D3, 4, oh, mortals. No! How many wounds has she got? Only three. She dies. Yeah. I can't even think about it. You can't. Oh, do you mind if I just, she's, can I just, yeah. can I remove it because I killed it? Yeah. Yeah. Do some fun stuff. Yeah. All right, chat. Get out of here. Well done, chat. You've Death killed the saboteur. Boom. She was holding an objective. She had a one-shot massive uh, grenade to blow up that Oh, rhino. yeah. Oh. Yeah. That's really frustrating. It is very frustrating, but you know what? Oh, well. <laughs> My Dreadnought's almost dead, and you've done almost nothing to contribute yeah, to that. I know, it's awesome. The chat's almost killed it. Yeah. Um, cool. Thank you so much. Um, that actually puts us uh, pretty close to another sniper shop. Or is that yeah, a new? We are 10 bucks away. 10 yeah. bucks away? Wow. No, uh, cool the, to honor the question a little bit more, too. I, I, have, I have all of them, except for... Um, Murder Fang. I actually don't own a Murder Fang. It's like one of the few Space Wolf characters that I don't have. Ooh, I feel I like Murder have... Fang is just oh, taking you know right what? I don't. No, no, no. He has a specific model. He does, but it's um, tiny. Oh, so? It's so awesome. tiny. I also don't. I actually don't have a Bjorn either. I don't have the two character dreads. If I was into Space Wolves, I'd want to mod up um, uh, a Redemptor Dreadnought to be Murder Fang. And oh, right. Well, Brutalis you'd probably use. Yeah, with the, or Brutalis. With, oh, the, so with the little cool. claw. Can we both yeah. do the claw thing one more time? All right, the so. The claw thing? We're, You're not doing yeah, it with me. Oh, can you just. <laughs> okay, anyway. Okay. <laughs> All right. Right there. Those, uh, Goose, if you're getting more money, for, that's great. Thank you so much. There's some you, great exclusives so out there. You need to roll an eight the here Steelers, to make that happen. The Gene Steel and the Patriarch are trying to charge into yeah. the Rhino. What I'm trying to do is get an eight so I can go around here and get yeah. behind any lines. Oh, uh, sorry. I was doing it for oh, right whatever, here. Wherever it goes, let me. Because you got to go a sure. little bit for. Oh! You need to get a nine. So you, eight is Thank right. You, if you go right here, you're golden. Thank you, Adam. So that's another shot for the Dreadnought. Kill the battle tank. I'll so do it. We still have three shots here. Uh, you know what? This one's for you for the battle tank. This one's for me for the Dreadnought. And this one is going to be a random 50-50. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. But um, let's do the charge here. Here we go. Well, Celia, thank you. Shoot a space brain. Um, that's a nine, Steve. The nine. Oh, yeah, you you can move me in. So that'll get. Do you want to be on this? You, a nine gets you on this can side. Can I be on this side? Because then I'm hitting yep. from shots. Yep. That's Absolutely. Much, that's much better. All right, so those gene steers over there are going to be in combat, but now they're yeah. in the deployment zone, yeah, which means it makes sense the... to try to do this one. So sounds I'm going to try to charge this big giant unit of bikes into this unit of intercessors. Yep, sounds good to me. 
Here we go. Oh, Four. I don't know if that's that good. is terrible. No, that doesn't nope, make me. That's not happening. I think that is worth a command point reroll. Okay, here we go. Um, do you mind if I try to get the free command point? Off of is it what? Too late. I, if I'm what? pulling objective with these guys on a four up, I get a command point. Is that like during your command phase yeah. or something? It's yeah, too late. you can just do it. All right, that's very kind of you. Thank you. I get it. Thank you. So I'm back up to one. I spent one for a reroll on this charge. Okay. Thanks, Steve. Good no support. problem. Um, so four, five, six, seven. Yeah, That'll get me in. Probably gets it. That'll get me in. All right, seven, all the way to here, and then seven. Oof. Oh, I should move this one first. Settlers of Satan, come on. This is going to be hard to get guys in base contact, to be honest. Yeah. I won't be able to get them all. Uh, but I, with, I, you got to get the whole thing in there, though. That's the, that's the challenge. I got to kill the unit. And then do what, though? I guess I got to do... I got to I got to do yeah, I've got to move around. How do I move around? Oof. I don't think I can get the whole unit in. I don't know if you can get the whole unit. That's <laughs> we'll a big try. unit to try. You we'll needed a gigantic charge. I did need a good charge. Yeah. Yeah. Um All right. That's charges. You're not doing anything special no. that I know of. Great. Um do you still have that command point? Yeah. Yeah, you do. So uh, Steve should have one and I should have one. Yeah. Command oh, point. I have yeah. one, yeah. All right, let's fight. Patriarch first. No, uh, yeah, Patriarch first. Patriarch's gonna go into, with the Gene Sealers, into your Rhino over there. Okay. The Patriarch. Uh, first of all, uh, take a Battleshock test. Sure. Because I have a Psychic Scream. I, oh, I am, I fail. So you're Battleshocked. Okay. Here you go. This is not gonna make much of a difference. Yep, I fail. Um, okay, so the Patriarch gets five attacks. Okay. Hitting on twos. Hit them all. Sweet. Um, I have Devastating Wounds and Twin Linked. Sweet. So I have a strength of six. Wounding me on fives. I wound you once, but it's a Devastating Wound. Twin Linked. Uh, oh yeah, Twin Linked, thank you. Appreciate that. No problem. Two Devastating Wounds. Ooh. Uh, minus two, they do two damage each. Two damage apiece, all right. They become mortals, so you can't save them. Oh, right, okay, yeah. so sure. Four so mortal four wounds. Four mortals. Yeah. Not a problem at all. Bam, I have six wounds left. Excellent, and then the uh, the Gene Stealer is going to fire at you yeah. with his four attacks, okay. uh, hitting on twos, uh, hits four times, strength four, wounds you twice, uh, minus two. Uh, Ooh, snake eye. Two more damage. Yeah. Well, one each. Yeah, so yeah, two damage total. Sounds good. Four wounds remaining. Well done, guys. Yeah, you're crushing it. Oh wait, that was a six. Uh, you wouldn't have got to save it. It was it would became mortal wounds because the whole unit gets devastating wounds oh, when okay. he's leading it. Sounds good. Uh, not a big deal. Uh, so next we're gonna go with this big giant unit of uh, riders, um, and they're gonna fight you. Let's fight with the jackal alphas first. Yeah. Uh, jackals, and jackal alphas gets w three attacks, right. hitting on threes, hits three times. Hits them all. Strength of three. Wound you none. Ooh. And then the jackals themselves, they each have two attacks. And Love it. there is 10 guys there um, with their Atlan power weapons. Okay. Um, so two, four, six, eight, 10. Two, four, six, eight, 10. And just make sure I'm not cheating you here. Um, yep, they can change. I, just making sure all of them can take power weapons. Totally. Yep, all of them taking power weapons. So hitting on fours. That's not bad. And then this is a strength of four. So wounding on fours at minus two. That's three, just three at minus two. Three at minus two, they do one damage each. Sounds good, five ups. Oh, I didn't. I uh, make none of them. Sorry, I. we need to restart this whole thing. A, not all of them could be in combat, and B, I forgot to pile in. Okay. <laughs> While we're embracing our mistakes, just like the joke that was set out there, <laughs> the joke up there was, my wife, I told my wife to embrace her mistakes, and then she hugged me. Uh, wait, 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 wait. 
wait, stop, 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 stop. So he wasn't his, a base contact. Not, are you sure? Yeah, yeah he's he not wasn't able to make okay. it in. Sounds good. So he, he's giving me the extra three inches here, um, three inches to here. Uh, well, he he bases contact. He has three inches to here, three inches. Could to here. he have base? But it's to here, right? It's a yeah. corner. Yeah, I can't yeah, get him you're, you're not gonna be able to get him all in. Yeah. He, he couldn't have based. That's but as far as he While has. we're doing this, what should happen actually is at the end of the charge phase, we rattle off these. So one into the dreadnought. Because charge phase is Oh, the right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Phase. Thank you. Not a problem at all. So there's four that weren't able to make it into fight. Sure. That's fine. So. Sorry about that, Steve. One into uh, the dreadnought. Uh, so, oh, sniper shot into the dreadnought. Yeah. Right! Subphase, sniper shot into the dreadnought. It's not a subphase. It's the end of a phase. Oh, it doesn't it do misses. it. It misses. It misses. Excellent. It misses. Uh, and then there is this one. I believe this one was uh, earmarked for the battle tank. I, he said tank, so I think you can yeah. choose whichever tank you uh, want. The Lehman Russ. Sure. Uh, I'll, I'll go with. Anti so, everything two, two up. up. Oh, totally does. Omnivore wounds. Uh, so D three does two mortals. Ooh, very nice. Right? Very nice. And then there was one randomly decided here. Yeah. So one two three for me. Four five six for you. Okay. One two three you. Four five six me. And it goes to you. Ooh, so the Lehman Ross has 11 wounds left. And, oh, chat, where should it go? Chat, where should it go? Um, I want to, I want to kill that land, uh, that, that rhino. Okay. okay, into the rhino, into the rhino. It hits and does one mortal wound. Does one whole mortal wound. down to Ooh, three. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah. Okay, sounds okay. good. All right, so let's do this again. There's... Four that can't get in combat. So there's right. only six fighting. Sounds good. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And there's no AP one, two, three, here, four, or there's some six. AP here. Uh, these have AP two. These have AP two. Okay. Yeah. I am going to armor of contempt to make it only AP one. Okay. All right. So I hit you on fours, and then I wound you on fours because oh, strength. Really four good roll. Two. There was a three in there. I thought I took it out. Sorry. No. It's all good. Thank you. Uh, okay, so on fours, there's four at minus two. Four at minus two. go to minus one because of the stratagem one. you did. Uh, so, uh, four Arm up. Attempt. So, four ups. Uh, so, one guy takes one damage. Why did I hurt you? What did I do, Rhino? <laughs> oh, the Rhino. Oh, I see. <laughs> so, one does what? One guy takes one damage. Oh, it's just one guy that yeah. killed? Yeah. Um, I could consolidate into you. Oh, uh, uh, I do that now. Yes, I do yeah. that now. Um, I don't ever do enough actual close combat ability. So, it just gets them closer in. That's it. Uh, so, Shay Bertrand, thanks so much to the whole team on Play On for getting me into 40K, and your guest, uh, who will be the next Primarch. Ooh, I should, uh, and should I hold off on buying an army till 10th edition codex, or it comes out? Hmm. Um, I think we're gonna be a long time. If you look at how long it was before between Gilliman and uh, the lion, the lion, yeah, I don't think we'll see another. Well, but you know what though, the distance between uh, the distance between Angron and the lion was I very close. I could see, um, close I could see uh, um, one of the, the demon ones. Yeah, the demon ones seem to be like their popular Bravo choices. Or... Perturabo, <laughs> the one no. that nobody knows about. Not Perturabo. Get out of here. <laughs> it's not going to be Perturabo. <laughs> Uh, you know what though? I you, do you know what I have always wanted? I have always wanted to see uh, Lehman Russ come out of the warp. All wolf and eyes. Yeah, yeah, full on cool. wolf and eyes. Like he's just like a giant wolf? werewolf. Oh. Like that would be rad. But he's still got the long flowing blonde. I could blonde see Fulgrim coming out. Next Primark will be Steve. But <laughs> Fulgrim, I could definitely see that coming it, out. If you any of you, I would like a twist. I would like Fulgrim to come out and actually be loyalist. Wow. No. Because of the- Absolutely not. Okay, so there- Absolutely not. There was that- there, 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 No. Why? Absolutely not. There's tons of lore about We're him. not gonna start this. Uh, people in the chat, I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, keep going. I had something and then I was gonna, I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> Regardless. Oh, if any of you know you anybody got, at Games got. Workshop that that is a sculptor or is any kind of position of power to tell the sculptors to do anything, I would be so eternally grateful if they made a little Space Marine Steve model. We have a model. Space Marine Steve. No, 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 no. I'm saying if they wove it into the actual universe, like, <laughs> oh yeah, that'd be rad. Just like some kind of Imperial commander or something looks like me. That'd okay. be phenomenal. Okay. I'd be all of that. That would be my main wish. To be like, I have a I'm, main wish I right know. now. I, I have mean, a, if, I have the Space Marine Steve model. you put a cigar in your mouth and you wore the big trench coat. Oh yeah, you I, I, I kind of look Creed. like Creed. Yeah, you I could look like Creed. Creed. I could pass for Creed. That's a good Halloween costume, actually. We should one day go as a play on command squad. 
That should be kind of funny. A, a Halloween command squad? Like, <laughs> that'd be awesome. JT can be the medic, like all hunched over. <laughs> Why is JT and, like, the medic? I don't know. I'm just choosing them. JT can be the medic. He can, like, f sit down and just have, like, bandages everywhere. I want to be the and then, sniper. Like, you can be the you can be the sniper guy. Yeah. Tack can hold the flag. <laughs> All right, fight me back here and fight okay. me back over there. Actually, funny enough, the guy with the flag does have did have a rule that was actually called "Listen up, maggots," and like that. I mean, yeah. Tack's never said that, but I've seen him say it with his eyes. <laughs> hey, corn saved me a boatload of money and sanity. <laughs> yeah. All right, roll, roll. These Marines <laughs> attacking you. these guys. Uh, there. Oh, right. There's two of them. To. There's two of them. Huzzah! Oh no, I missed one. Uh, I keep. This is bad. I'm just. You're rolling terribly. Just horrible. Sorry. You're rolling average. All of them miss. You're rolling Steve average. All of them. All of them don't hit and don't wound. Really? Bad. You just, yeah. Not a single. Just wound. Not a all right. Can the rhino damage? Just horrible. Maybe. Sealer? On force. I got, ooh, two hits, that's pretty good. Uh, strength six, oh yeah, on threes. on threes, let's do it. Nope, neither. <laughs> nothing. I get nothing. I get nothing. All, All right. right. All cool. Right. Well, that's All that. All right, okay, so for my secondaries, I was not able to get behind enemy lines because yeah, I didn't get, get these here. guys in here. So, I don't want to be the guy with the communication device. I want to be the guy that gets to wear the big trench coat. The thing is, if I hold on to both of these, I think I can score both of these. That's the problem. I wish they luck. So I might draw one next turn that might not be able to be scored. So you know what? I'm going to risk it. I'm going to hold on to both of them. You're holding on to both? I'm holding on to both. You're a champion. What's the first one again? The first one is capture your enemy oh, outpost, so that one over there. Yes. The second one is behind enemy lines. I've got two units that are almost in behind enemy lines. Yep. I've got deep strikers that could be in there. Totally. I've got a good chance of doing this. It's possible. So we're going to try it. I mean, you're not like wrong. All right, so you're good then? I'm, I'm All right, good. We're so going on. End of my turn, I scored zero points. Sweet. So I you were it. winning for nothing. I love every and minute of that. And then you control one objective at the beginning of your okay, turn. Hold on. Uh, so we each gain a command point. Yes. Uh, and I'm then. I'm at two. Steve's at one. one. Okay. Uh, and then what's going to happen uh, is I am going to. <laughs> Spare Dr. Rhino. Uh, the Jackal Squad as my oath of moment target. Yeah, it makes sense. Uh, and then after that, I am also going to, because I believe that this happens during the command step. Uh, yeah, so I am going to uh, Blessing of the Omnisaya from my Tech Marine into the Dreadnought that's super duper wounded that the Fix chat seems to have a grudge against. Yeah, so D3. Is uh, this it's live saves? live? One? Yes, it's live. This is live. So I, 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 I wonder I if the one. live and uncut was, was a giveaway. Uh, I heal one, and it gets plus one to hit, uh, which is going to absolutely help, because I think I actually just popped it. Oh, no, it's still damaged. So oh, I'm, yeah, he gets I'm, mad, and he's like, oh, yeah, yeah you well, play better. Well, he, when, he gets mad when, when a vehicle dies. Uh, when a vehicle dies, yeah, he gets really right. upset. It's kind of funny, actually. Yeah, it's like, actually awesome. He gets really, really mad about it. grabbing his like, hood thing and throwing it down and oh, stomping yeah. on him, be like, Aah! And then, uh, oh, at the end of the battle round, neither of us, you killed one unit, so you get... Uh, oh, right. Actually, I don't know if that happens. Can I see the card, please? Um, it's, uh, it's in every battle round, it says. OK. So um, I killed a unit, and you killed no units. Yeah, so he so, gets four points. So I actually going. do get points, because the, the, the primary secondary yeah. <laughs> but he gets, um, yeah. is, kill, is kill more units. Yeah. And How then, live are we now? I, I the, don't know. I score four, four points right now, um, uh, Owen as well. So we each gain four. Okay, sounds good. Do we so, ever actually live? How do we live ever are actually we? live? Hi, everyone. Hi, Euroxy. At Nick, oh, so yeah. about this loyal Fulgrim thing, tell me more about it. Well, no, if you read happening. all the Horse Heresy books, there actually is a clone of Fulgrim, and at the moment when Fulgrim killed um, uh, his brother, uh, there was a moment of clarity, and he realized what he'd done, and he tried to... Uh, there's a bit of a bit of conjecture there. It's mm. possible that... The Fulgrim running around is actually an inhabited demon, and he's actually, the real one is living in a painting somewhere. It's a little oh, bit weird. That is weird. And uh, this, like, demon painting that he got, like, sucked into that was originally inhabited by demons, and darn. it's, yeah, it's a bit of a, a, bit of a weird thing. But it's possible that there's a loyalist Fulgrim waiting to be unleashed somewhere. Waiting to be unleashed somewhere. Whereas the Fulgrim that is out there leading his legion is actually a demon. Yeah. And then, then, Ful, uh, then uh, what's his name? Um, the... The, the 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 scientist dude, the traitor scientist dude. Oh yeah, um, yeah, yeah I don't know. Is, I yeah, whatever his name is, he's um, he's been working on a clone of Fulgrim. Hmm. Hmm. 
All right, so uh, here's what's gonna go down. Uh, oh, and then... Uh, oh, and we, then sorry, I wanna acknowledge Cool. Thank you very much for the donation. That puts us, I think, $40 away from the next sniper shot. Thank you for starting us off. I feel like we had, because the Horus Heresy novel is nearly done and the most interesting part of the Primark, I think they will release more just to do popularity. Hmm. Could, Could be. be. Maybe. Uh, the, the um, by the way, the, the medic it? scientist dude is um, Fabius Bile. Fabius Bile. Why is Fabius that factor three? Uh, so it, at the, during my command phase, this has a, its special rule is called self-repair. It regains one wound every single Machine command Machine spirits. Yeah, self-repair. <laughs> Just, it knows what's up. It knows what's up. It knows what's up. Uh, alrighty, so. Uh, all right, I think I know how I'm going to do this now. And I, I, st I pulled Storm Hostile Objective and deployed Teleport Homer. I'm probably not going to be able to get Deploy teleport Homer. That's put, um, that's do an objective, but, do an action either in the center or might deploy. Yeah, and I, but that's okay. And storm hostile objective is take uh, an objective away from me. Yeah, which so really I'm just gonna have one. to just do that one in the middle there, which will be a challenge. But uh, I you think assault it's ramps, possible. Though, right? I do have an assault ramp. I probably it's probably better to to just. Oh yeah, you're thinking go take these guys out. Well, no. You did oath a moment with these guys. I did, and that's okay. Yeah. Uh, all right, so here we go. I think uh, I'm. I'm good to start my movement phase. Uh, so things that are going to happen right now uh, is uh, my Rhino is going to back out. And because it's Battleshock, <laughs> it has to desperate break out. Uh, no, because at the beginning of your oh, right, turn, yeah. it becomes uh, but it, uh, But it might not actually, because it is actually below half. Yes. So Battleshock test for the Rhino. Oh, it's OK. And yeah. Battleshock test for these Marines over here. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Uh, they are Battleshock. And Battleshock test for your oh, yeah, and the dread. Dreadnought over there. That's okay. Okay, so this these guys are battle shocked to me, so they're full back, they might kill themselves. Um uh, but the dread uh Victor the, Hendor the, his bottle with the make of the clone. You are correct. That so Victor's take us closer my, to the sniper shot. Uh, um land uh, sorry, my uh, Rhino is gonna yeah. fall back over here and take this objective. Um and then this unit here is gonna move forward and uh, huddle around this objective so that uh, it becomes very, very difficult for you to drop within three of it and do that kind of nonsense. Don't want that. Yeah, because I can drop within three yeah, with a strategy. That's not what we want. Yeah. Uh, and then I'm going to go. I, those two guys back there are going to fall back. So ones and twos kill ones the guys. Ones and twos. Uh, <laughs> kills them both. <laughs> kills them both. That is Steve. Look. Steve oh, my luck. goodness. Uh, you're all seeing it here in real time. Real time. So there's a kill for you, unfortunately, which I don't yeah, love. That counts as a kill for me. That's not, I don't love that, Nick. <laughs> I don't love that. <laughs> yeah, come on over, I said. Let me give you a hug. I don't love that. Hug. Don't touch me, Nick. Don't touch me. <laughs> uh, all right, so what's the distance on these? The so salt ramp means you can move and then get out mm -hmm. and, and charge. And I still get to charge, yeah. yeah. Zig, uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. Zig Jack? Zig Jack? Uh, been a YouTube member for over a year. Thank you so much. And has donated four dollars, which means we have a sniper shot. Where do you want it to go? Oh, into the jackal elfus? No. Yeah. Now we did say the unit didn't have precision shots. So that means into the unit of uh, jackals right here. We right. will do that at the end of the movement phase. Uh, so I am within three of this objective. Yeah. So you got the objective, and then you're gonna get the guys out and, and go then here. And get think? the guys out, and they're probably gonna jump into the middle. We're gonna go this way. So that I can get storm target. hostile objective. I really need to get storm hostile objective. Yeah. So I need to take my big. Brick unit of Terminators, along with um, Dynath, Lysander, and hopefully, hopefully, make this charge. Yeah, that's the hope. The big hope. The big. In my big. in my heart of hearts, I'm really hoping that this is going to happen for me. Really, really hoping. Ooh, is there a point to Overwatching? Uh, no. <laughs> Probably not. I was tempted to overwatch actually at that um, that rhino right there with the Rogaldorn. I've got enough shots that a lucky shot got through and it would kill it. Yeah. Boy. And you're within melter range? Yep. Tempting. Let's make sure I stay outside of. Uh... Ooh. How are you gonna deal with these? Dreadnought? Oh, take your wounds with you. Take your four wounds with I you. I don't want to. <laughs> uh, yeah, probably. These oh. these terminators are terrifying. So you do now when you get to do the rearrange move. So if I end within nine inches of you, you get it to move, right? There is no rule. I don't well, have that's anything. Not a thing. I don't have that. No. I There's nothing. 
Um, maybe. Unless there's a stratagem that I maybe miss. No. It could be a stratagem that lets me do that. Well, maybe it's just when you shoot or something. When I shoot, I get to do a free move. Oh, maybe it's maybe it's when you Overwatch with them, then you get to Overwatch and then move. Um, Jack of Office in your shooting phase, only in my shooting phase. Oh, weird. Okay, great. I think I'm gonna take this guy and run this way with him. Make sure he holds onto that lone operative. Okay, cool. And just so people watching at home, I still have two units in reserves. I have a unit of neophytes and a unit of uh, acolytes that are in reserves uh, with a primus attached to it. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's see what's going on here. Uh, all right, so I am going to start uh, with the land raider. And the land raider is going to shoot everything um, back into yeah, that makes the, sense. It's a great that target squad, for it. except for the hunter killer missile, which is going into your Lehman Rust. Got it. Yeah, it is a great target for it. You could probably yeah. pick up a lot of them. That's the hope. Yeah. Shia Bertrand, really, really thank hopeful. you so much. Sincerely, thanks again for inspiring me to play. Awesome. You're, yeah. Should very, I hold very out very for welcome. the Codex in tenth to buy an army or just pull the trigger? I have the basic set. Well, the army is going to be the same in tenth edition. Uh, they have promised new models with the codexes, so yeah. that's something to wait for, I guess. No, but I, 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 I mean, I wouldn't go like ham with it like if you if you're let's say you're if you're purchasing warhammer on a budget right which i know like that's something that i always have to keep track of yep. and and what everyone does is i would say like buy what you need to begin with to start it's an playing enhancement. that's what it is vanguard oh vanguard's oh, here that's thank you it it's an enhancement that does it and i did have oh, the points oh okay that's okay you know what they do have that because <laughs> okay. i have the enhancement Absolutely not. <laughs> You've told me like so many times. They don't have it, but I'm not, they I'm don't not gonna do it. I'm it. not gonna do it, but that's what it was. Okay, it is an, all right, so I'm not crazy. Thing. You're not crazy. I'm not crazy, I do know, okay. Before you shoot, we have a sniper shot. Oh, okay, sure. Yeah, I right, will, where's the sniper shot going? Oh, right, it's into your, the Alphys, the Yeah, jackals. into the Jackals. All right, on so, two up. Moody on a two. Totally does. D3, D3 mortals. mortals. One. Uh, I did one damage to the quad. Yeah, sure. Uh, alrighty, so from uh, everything from the Land Raider just slams in there except for the uh, Hunter Killer Missile. So Hunter Killer Missile on a two up into the uh, Lehman Rust, it hits. Uh, so it's strength 14 to your toughness of 12, I believe. So on threes, and that is a wound at AP minus three. Uh, on the Lehman Rust. On the Lehman Rust. On the Lehman Rust! Come on! No. No, go D6 through. damage. For five. Five. Whoa. Oh, rough. Loving it. Uh, five, so I'm at... Uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, but six wounds remaining. Boom! Look at that. Six wounds remaining on the Lehman Ross. Uh, oh, Lord okay. Rahul, I'm torn between having Sanguinius back or not, but I would happen to be some Elder Shenanigans to make it happen. Thank you, Lord Rahul. Uh, that puts us like ten dollars away from the next sniper shot. And Steven, I hope I'm doing you proud. I'm trying to play, play uh, Steven Boxy. Uh, we have not not had any Steven Box cars yet. Steven Box cars yet. Uh, we, me and Steven agreed that anytime double sixes are rolled, that is a Steven Box cars, and I will announce it on camera. And, but, Steven box but the, cards. But the, the, the trade-off. What's the toughness of the jackals? Four. Uh, four. The trade-off was if he ever had triple sixes on his channel, he had to call them uh, a Nick special. The Nick special. <laughs> I thought the Nick special was just split firing unsuccessfully. <laughs> I'm trying to make a new thing. Oh. I don't think that should be a new thing. I think whenever someone irresponsibly split fires on your channel, <laughs> you make a really big deal of it, Steve. <laughs> really big deal of it. Uh, so that's uh, five so far. Sorry, this land raider is going to take a couple of minutes to shoot. Do you want to talk to the chat for a second while I? Tack, where up? are we going? I haven't been back for four years. Who else is coming? Where are we going? <laughs> oh, we're going to Japan. Oh, okay. Split fire to victory. Split fire. I, I have to a victory. button for that. Look, Steve, you should do more of this. See, you even have a. I actually did just split fire, and I'm, I was doing very well with it. Because the, the hunter like, killer missile went. You can't hear it because we don't have it enabled here. But the people at home are hearing like this rock and roll anthem while it plays. Oh my god! It was like na 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 na. So this is all into the jackals. Uh, so far, this is all into the jackals. Got it. I, keep interacting with the chat while I I finish this. Oh, just, you're just gonna surprise me with a whole bunch of dice. Yeah. <laughs> Steve is back. Yes. It's split fire to sadness. Do you guys Split think an Elder Combat Patrol Wraith Lord could beat an Orc Combat Patrol Death Dread? I, I gotta say, for all the Combat Patrols we've played, so many of them have been so close. All the games have been so close. Um, I feel like the Eldar versus the Orc one would actually be a really good matchup. Um, I haven't noticed any of them struggle too much. They both been, like, they feel fairly fair. Okay. Are you ready for this? Shoot the weakest units so we can destroy it from cool. Are you ready for cool. this? Does that put us over? 
Is that? Uh, not quite. So we're like, what, like, 15, we're 15 dollars more. Are you ready cool. for this now? All right. So 15 AP minus nothings. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. See, because I was talking to chat, usually I count out the dice while the person's yeah. going to speed things along, but. Yep. All right, 15 AP nothings. Oof. I have a four up save. No, I have a five up save, but I have cover. Yes. So I will take a four up save. Oh. That's not enough. Oh no. That's absolutely so, not enough. So the quad is dead. One bike is dead. Another bike is dead. So that's two bikes in the quad, three bikes, four bikes. You killed four bikes in a quad. I love it. That's half the unit. I love it. Well done. And then three AP minus ones. Oof. So I say four bikes or three bikes in a quad? I, I believe. I don't know. I think it was four. Okay. Um, all right. And, and then, then three, three AP, AP minus, minus ones. ones. Okay. Uh, save none. Okay, great. One, one damage or two damage? One damage. All right. So killed and down to one wound. And then two mortal wounds. Killed and down to one wound. All right. All right. So I have two quads and, uh, and a bike and the sniper left in that Excellent. unit. I love it. Wow. Uh, and then the Redemptor Dreadnought's going to shoot everything into it as well? Yep. All righty. Here yeah. we go. You know what? I should have done the stratagem to, because I know you're shooting and it's a high, high volume uh, shot. I should have done the stratagem to give me stealth. Oh, it would have been sorry. Um, I mean, I, I'm mostly saying this for the people at home watching because they want to learn how to play too, um, and they're learning from watching. Um, this would have been a great one with the shadows. It usually is for um, for someone targeting someone outside of twelve, so you don't get shot. But this would have given me stealth, which means the dreadnought, which means all these bolter shots would have only been hitting at minus one. It means I probably could have saved a couple more bikers. Ah, got it. What size table do you play on? Play on tabletop. This is a six by four table. Um, I like it because of the sideboard. You get space. Uh, so uh, five AP nothings with the Onslaught Gatling Cannon. Okay. No cover for this one. Uh, you've Oof. killed Rough. killed the bike, killed uh, and killed the AP one, AP nothing. AP nothing. Okay. You've uh, uh, killed the bike and the quad is down to one wound. I've got one quad, one quad with one wound and the sniper. All right, uh, the uh, rocket pod, so on threes. Well, I guess, sorry, might as well put the one and then uh, strength eight, so on twos. Uh, one AP minus one, two damage. The turn counter is correct. This is turn two. One AP minus two, two damage. Sorry, AP minus one, two damage. Uh, save it. You're good. Uh, okay, and then D6 plus one shots off of the... Um, this is the dreadnought still, the, the rocket dreadnought, The dreadnought still. Yeah. Uh, so this is on threes, you're rolling. Uh, and then on twos, you're rolling. All right. Uh, so four AP minus threes. Oh, just already through. Kills him. All right, two damage a piece. Uh, two damage a piece. Oh, yeah. yeah. Dead. So two damage a piece, and they're minus three? Yeah. But I couldn't do anything about it. So okay. first one kills this guy. There were four total. Yeah. Second one, third one kills this guy, and then I have one left. That does three damage? Two damage. Two damage. So the Jackal Alphas is down to two wounds remaining. And then uh, D6 shots off the Frag Storm Grenade Launcher. Oh, one. there's still more? Still more. What guns do you freaking have? A lot. Uh, one AP nothing. One damage. Uh, okay. Save it. Cool. Sniper all by himself. All by himself, and that's okay. A little bit of fire uh, charge. And then my, uh, this Dreadnought here is going to shoot everything at the uh, um, Patriarch and his units. Okay, so that I will do. I will spend one command point to give myself stealth, and you can't fire at me with outside, outside of 12 inches. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. So you won't be able to fire there. So that, it was somewhere to not doing it here. Yeah. Uh, so then what's going to happen is I'm going to yeah I'm going to retarget everything into the Lehman Rust. Can you see what the range is between the Lehman Rust and this Dreadnought? Yeah. So the range is 20, 21. 21. Okay. Sounds good. So all my twenty-four inch weapons are just going to go into that Lehman Rust. Uh, Sense. Four, seven, eight. So Gatling cannon time. Are those on the next sides mostly they're destroyed? There is a unit uh, coming in from reserves here. So there is. I have a unit of acolytes. Of ten acolytes, ten neophytes, and unit of five acolytes. Uh, so two mortal wounds into the Lehman Russ. Two mortal wounds into the Lehman Russ. All right, down to four. D three shots off the rocket pod, and it's a uh, toughness twelve, right? It is toughness twelve. Wrong. Yeah. Okay, sounds good. So on fives. Ooh, Sorry, two uh, AP minus one. Toughness eleven. Toughness eleven. For okay, either Russ. way, uh, two AP minus ones, two damage apiece. Threes. Save both. Save them both. And then D6 plus one overcharge. Oh, nope. I'm not going to overcharge. You only got four. Cool. Thank left. you for the $10. Speaking of rules, some leaders have an ability to. Oh, actually, no. I am going to overcharge. You can use it to make a command roll 2 CP. So four. Uh, Three ups. One CP more. Essentially, yeah. Uh, that's exactly what it's for. 
Um, and that puts us five dollars for the next sniper shot. No. So if five dollars so comes I get in, nothing, the and then gets hazardous. Shot. No, I'm good. So no more shots for that. Uh, so cool, cool brought us five dollars away from the next sniper All right. shot. I love if, uh, it. That's how we support. Uh, it's, Thank a, it's you. It's a fundraiser, but also allows you, the chat, to contribute and be a part of the game and choose a target of fire with a sniper. Uh, so three of the bolt rifles will go into the Patriarchs unit. Okay. So I'm minus one, so I'm hitting on fours. Ooh, not phenomenal. Uh, and on fours, uh, two wounds. AP minus one, um, and you do you, have cover. You did shoot me at minus one to hit, right? I, yep. Yeah. I okay. did. Two at minus one. Yeah. Both go through. All right. So I kill this gene sealer. Yep, awesome. Ah, okay, now I gotta, I gotta right now on a four up that gene seal unit will come back. Right. Oh, I gotta do it for the bikes too. No, no the gene seal unit is not coming back. Woo. The bikes come back on a four up as well. They do come they back. They do. All right, so they go into ongoing reserves, okay. and I can put a blip right down right now. Okay. That can be how they come on, but to be honest, I'll probably just have them come on from the side. Okay. Um, Sounds good to me. I can put it anywhere on the board, can't I? I believe so, but I do. If you go with a nine, uh, yeah. I'm gonna go over here. Okay, I saw someone do this on Reddit. They counted it out. There actually is a way to do it that if you, you gotta put it exactly the right way and then you can put the whole the whole unit of 10 jeans there, or pikes there. Really ridiculous. Like for, cause you have to be wholly within three. You gotta wholly within, uh, you have to be six inches of this dot, but you also be, have to be within six, sorry, it's like here. You'd be six inches away from the edge, because the Atlan Jackals have a special rule saying that when you use the blip mechanic, you have to come in from the edge. Oh. Not only that, but if you use the blip, uh, the new rule for the, for the errata says you have to um, be within three or six. It's, it's close, it's really tight. Um, I think it's... This is one of those things, everybody, really where I would not recommend doing that. <laughs> <laughs> because you will never get it as precise as the math technically says it could be. Oh, so we mapped it out. They, they actually provided a, a 3D print template that you could put all the, oh the models on. Oh my goodness. On. Uh, hey, Duncan Thomas, fire the gun, and Sage Router, did Magnus do anything wrong? Ryan Asper picks the target. Thanks for awesome content, guys. Uh, Magnus totally did things wrong. Okay, no, no, the right, right question is, did Magnus do anything wrong? No, but he didn't do anything right. <laughs> okay, anyways, uh, so... so we, have, uh, we have a sniper shot. Yeah, we have a sniper shot. Uh, so I'm about to end my sh shooting phase, actually. So that's the end of my shooting phase. Okay. Hey. Um, so uh, three inches shot. of blip. Thank you. Three inches of blip. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right. So who got it right? Sage, who got it right? Which, which what did Max do? But he'll, he'll decide that while you do your shooting phase. I, my shooting phase is over. Oh, right. Okay, do your charge phase. Yeah, okay. Uh, so what's going to happen here is uh, the Dreadnought's going to charge uh, the Jackal. And Gravy, supporting Nick, even though you're not Tau today, cheers for all the hard work. The, Thank you, man. The Dreadnought rolled a 9 on the uh, charge. Would you mind moving the Dreadnought, please? Oh, Gravy saying we could t I could target whatever I want. Ooh. And you want to go to... You can? That's what he's saying. Oh, lame. Thank you, Gravy. Uh, and then the uh, Terminator unit's going into the Aberrants. Marcelia with an H, probably. Marcelia puts us over. That's two. Uh, would you mind just trying to help me out here? All right, what are you uh, trying to I get? Got, I got an eight. I just need to charge at yeah. the. Aberrants. Yeah, you, you will get in. So the okay. the terminators can go all the way to here. Yeah, slam me in there. Um, you know what? This will be easier to take this off. Sure. Yeah, that's fine. Because infantry, of course, can walk through the walls. Not a problem at all. Um, and we'll take this top off. Unless he glued it. He did glue it. That's fine. Um, then you're in base contact there, but I'm going to just put it that there. Okay. You're in base contact there. Wicked. Uh, you're in base contact There's only five there. of them, which means that they'll probably all get uh, combat. Base contact there. Okay. And now you're all in combat. Sounds good. Great. Alrighty, so... Uh, before you do combat, you need to do... Uh, we need to do the sniper shot. Sure. There's two sniper shots. Um, one is going to my target. And I'm gonna help me out by killing some Terminators. Sure. Into the Terminators! It wounds, it does! Three mortal wounds! Uh, Kill a Terminator! And I think it's only fair that you get to choose the other one. Uh, you know what? Hold on. 
Is there gonna be any Star Wars Legion coming on? Coming, uh, I would oh, like no. to, yes. I would very much like to. I'm trying to get the, um, yeah. the Shadow Collective painted yeah. so that I can use that. Owen actually wants to run the Shadow Collective, so we're hoping oh, to do me and Owen. Remove this, uh, the Power Sword guy. Rough. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, so then after that. Uh, Thanks, Sage. Thank you very yeah, much. Uh, so we'll go into. Yeah, we'll just start oh, you, with. You still the... have a shot. You have a sniper shot. Oh, I do have a yeah, sniper shot. Yeah, oh, you do. You do have a sniper shot. Okay, great. I love that. Uh, so what we'll do then is uh, we're just going to slam everything into. How many wounds does the Patriarch have? Probably like Twelve. five. Twelve. Twelve. It's not 12. Get Billion. out of here. Get out of here. Patrick has six wounds. Mm -hmm. Interesting. I think I'm gonna leave him alone. I'm gonna hit that Lehman Rust though. Make sure it's damaged. New uh, so on a two Thank up. You. Yeah, D3 mortals to the Lehman Rust. We're, we're halfway through to another shot. Three whole, mo th three whole mortals oh, to the Lehman Rust. Oh, Lehman Rust is down to one wound. One whole wound. Let's kill the Lehman Rust. Chat, well, get well, us there. We are $25 away from the next sniper shot. And hopefully going into the Lehman Rust. Woo. Uh, okay, so uh, I'm gonna start with my uh, Terminators. And uh, the Terminators are gonna take their power fists, all four of them. We're gonna go one. You're gonna try to kill two, these aberrants. Three, and uh, so the aberrants have a toughness of what again? Uh, six. Six, you say. I know it's eh? crazy, eh? So winning on threes. Uh, well, here's what's gonna happen I am going to uh, spend one command point, and I'm gonna honor the chapter then. Oh, that makes sense. And honor the chapter will give them lance, so they get plus yeah. one to wound. Such a uh, great ability. Uh, so, two, uh, three, uh, nine, 11, and 12. So, uh, hitting you on threes with these power fists. Bunch of hits, which feels great. And then wounding you now on twos, which feels good. Uh, so, one, two, three. Uh, so, eight AP minus twos. Eight AP minus twos, all of it two damage. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Minus two, so it just goes on, uh, well, it just goes right through. I only oh. have a five up save. Oh, you only have a five up save. Okay, great. So so, uh, so it's eight, four up, feel no pains, basically. Because they're one damage each? They're two damage a piece. Oh. But, so you got to do it, because they have three means. wounds a piece? They have three, each one has three wounds. Okay, so yeah. you got to do this four at a time then. Okay. Okay. So four, because... Because each, you you now have each, to okay, each attack does pick, two damage. So just pick up sixteen dice. Okay, four, five, yeah, yeah. Eight, pick up sixteen one, two, three, dice. Four, five, six. All right. And then don't roll it like that. Roll it four at a time. Okay. Yeah. All right. Four, four up. So here's two hits from power fists. Okay. Two go through. Okay. Great. So, so he's so one. Guy's so one guy's at one wound. One right. Guy's at one wound. Now pick another two. Pick another two. And away we go. Saves them both. Saves them both. Pick another two. Saves them both. Take another two. Death. Ah, uh, death. Okay, okay great. Uh, oh, so one guy had one wound left. So this this guy, oh. and then this guy's got to, uh, we got we to kill this oh, guy. Oh, okay. So yeah. then. He's alive. Yeah. And then he's dead. Okay, so, so you kill two. two guys. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, Denarth Lysander. That was pretty good. Oh, they're, they're, these, they're so tanky. They're so tanky. It's a four up feeling a little pain. Did like, Vasily just give another 25? Basically oh, never oh. exists. We're at another sniper shot. That's yeah, so on twos. All of them. Vasily, where's uh, that going? But... Okay. Okay, here we go. Uh, so, the, and these are then on twos. Uh, so, uh, so four AP minus three, so it cuts right through. Uh, so you, uh, they're three damage a piece. So the first guy takes three. Are these uh, one. minus three or something? They, they cut through your armor. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So save two, one goes through. Yeah, I'm at two da two wounds remaining. Yeah. Uh, and then the and next. Then the next guy has to save three again. Yeah. So he's still. So this is your second. Save two. One goes through. He's down to one wound. Yeah. And then one more. Oh. Sorry. Two. There's two more. Sorry. There's four total. Yeah. Wounds. Four total hits. Yeah. Yeah. So and then the, the next so one, one more. Kills him. Good. And now we're on uh, to the, the second last guy. Second last guy. And this is the last batch of three, which he fails and dies. Okay. It's just the <sighs> abominant left. Yeah. Uh, but. Uh, I am not going to go anywhere. So Does that I'm mean I can't fight you? Correct. Because we're too far out? Yeah, you're, you're no longer in game. I don't oh. pile in, don't I? Can't, is it a choice? I can't remember now. Uh, Do I have to pile in if I can? I can't remember. Oh, that's a good question. I don't know. I can't remember. If chat gets her first, great. 
Uh, but I'm gonna just double check. Consolidate. It, 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 yeah, be consolidating. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, so for those of you who just got gifted a membership, thank you so much, Marcelia, and um, was Newfie Edge, I think, that also donated some membership. Uh, thank you so much for that. Uh, membership is a great way to support the channel. It uh, goes a long way to keeping the lights on, keeping us going, and uh, it also gives you access to some amazing content, our, our amazing Discord. We have right now, they're up there on early access, the start of a new campaign. You can go check out our old campaigns. We've got new campaigns coming. Me and Steve are actually planning a really cool campaign for the, uh, for the fall, where we are gonna do um, a corrupted guard army that's basically being invaded by space marines, and we're gonna have this like corruptometer thing. It's gonna be fun. Um, and yes, as members, you can go back and watch Maselli Doubt play, play versus myself, and we have a whole bunch of other stuff on there that you can go find. Yeah. Um, so, and we have uh, regular live streams for members. We had one yesterday, for instance, where we played 40K Monopoly. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't say I have to, so I don't want to. I don't want to get yeah. in there. That's now, silly. From understanding, I don't get to. I don't pile think so, because you didn't make a charge and you're not within engagement range. Yeah, so, so I can't. I don't do... believe that you get to do that. No. I think I'm just out of luck. You just hang out. That yeah. sucks. And that's okay, I'm alright with it. I am okay with it. I just need to get the charge in my turn. That is true, yeah. Okay, that's kind of okay. Yeah. All right, fine. I'm all right with it. Oh, okay, that unit comes back on a four up. It's no. not coming back. Oof. Get out of town. Oof. Get out of town. Four units are gone. Yes. Oof. Okay, great. I'm feeling good. All right, cool. So, uh, I am going to discard, uh, deploy, teleport. Oh, sorry. Uh, the dreadnought. Attacks, oh, right. That you see, you can kill my yeah, uh, uh, a sniper here with the dreadnought rolling. into my sniper. It's the oath targets so are probably dead. It dies. Really, really hard, yeah. And these don't come back. Bye, sniper. Ooh, okay. you're chewing through my guys like Chewing right paper. through it. Uh, okay, so I do get storm hostile objective nope. for five points. Yeah. Yeah, storm hostile for five points. And I'm going to discard, deploy teleport Homer for an extra command point. Okay. So you're at I go two, to command, two points? command points? Two command points, yeah. Okay, uh, I'm, am I still at one? Uh, yeah, so it is. So, yeah. Um, and then we go to the end of your turn. Do you score any points? Uh, so that, I just did that. Oh, sorry. I apologize. Yeah, yeah. of course you did. <laughs> well, I feel like you're not listening to me sometimes. <laughs> Honestly, it's because I'm paying attention to that at the same time. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm just. I'm, bugging I'm sorry you, that you feel like I'm not paying attention. I just to you. bugging you. You Nick. are bugging me. I know. Um, okay. We go to my turn. I hold one objective marker. Correct. So Just you have one. four command point. Sorry, uh, victory point. I gotta knock you off these objective workers. Correct. Um, I get a command point going up to two. Uh, I don't have anything to battle shock. Oh, the tank. The tank might be battle shocked. Oh yes, the battle. Because you took this, turned this into a character. Yeah, you turned I that did. into a character. Yep. Uh, five, six, seven. We're good. With the... You're good. Patriarch. You're good. And oh, sorry for the uh, leaving Russ. Mm-hmm. I gotta make some hard choices here, sir. Some hard life choices. Hard life choices. <sighs> All right. This is tough, man. I still have my secondaries. I still have capture enemy outposts and behind the lines. So take an objective away from you and get two guys with it, two yes. units within your deployment zone. Absolutely. That's going to happen this turn. That's happening. That's happening. That's happening? That's happening. All right. So, um, no other command stuff to, oh, I can get a command point from this guy right here. Uh, my my uh, neophytes are going to try to give me a command point on a four up. They Tag do not. says, thanks, I had a blast playing Steven Box. Actually, yeah. Playing, he was amazing. He was a lot playing, of fun. Playing Steven Box. It was amazing. Was, yeah, it's a highlight. Yeah. Steven Box is my hero. As much as I'm his hero. I thought I was your hero. No. <laughs> yeah, to, to, be honest, to be honest, I, I felt like I, I got to connect with Steve in like a really cool way and like he's, yeah. he's an amazing guy. He yeah, so much exactly. fun. Exactly. Oh, yeah. He, yeah. That was, it was definitely a highlight. Yeah. I had so much fun playing Steven that it was. Yep. Yeah. Okay. We gotta kill things, man. We gotta kill things. So. We are going to uh, advance this to Hirish. I don't want you to be able to watch. Can you advance and charge? I can advance and charge. Ooh. Six. Six. So can you move me where you can't? Give me the best possible charge without being shot. Okay. 
You need to roll like a five. Good. All right. Um, the Abominant is saying, I'm going to kill you. He's not going to move. Yeah, that checks out. He's going to sit there and he's going to wail on you really hard. I love it. Um, this uh, tank is going to move far enough forward that it won't explode and kill my own guys. That checks out. <laughs> but far enough forward that it might explode and kill your guys. Um, oh, right. We forgot the sniper shot. Oh, thank you for the sniper shot. Um, is that for you? I think so, but I don't know so. Owen, do you remember? Uh, ooh, we gotta, we gotta go back here. <laughs> but, uh, oh, that was a, oh, wait, that was a 50. Oh, no, that's way more. 50 is five, is, is, uh, five sniper shots. What? He, he donated 50 memberships. Oh, is that 50 oh, memberships, oh, not 50 bucks? Oh, okay. That's 50 oh. memberships, oh. which are $5 each. Oh, yeah, okay. That is five sniper shots. All right. Yeah. Frick. All right, chat, chat. Um, the first five targets that I see are the first five targets where these sniper shots are going. So Whoa. ready, set, go. There's a, there's a bit of delay. So those are sitting here ready while I'm finishing my movement phase. Okay. Um, 10 inches, does that get me on the objective? It does. Could, uh, this is moving up exactly three inches away. So one into the banana tech marine. One of the tech marine. Yep. Uh, just put that aside. Yep. Um, oh, no, Moselli has said. There you go. Yep. Into the tech off. marine. Yeah, I know that. I, I, I'm doing yep. it. You do your movement phase. Fine. I got this. It's all good. Um, good. We're bringing some stuff down. Uh, it was the bikes. One into the Rogel. Uh, not the bikes. The bikes are coming in later. Um, unit of Acolytes. Do you have a Keller Morph somewhere? No. There's no color morph. No color morph. One into my glasses. No. I'm gonna use a command point so I can show up within three inches of you. And I'm gonna pop back here. You could set me up within three inches All right. there. So, uh, Tech Marine, Dreadnought, uh, and then the uh, Rogel, the uh, um, uh, Lehman Russ, and then into the Land Raider. Those are them. Bam. So these are, you want three, how many inches away? Uh, three inches away, please. Okay, sounds good. <clears throat> um, uh, one guy is not supposed to be here. There's only yes, five of these guys, right? There's five guys and a Primus. Oh, this guy's, a, this guy's a Primus? No, that guy's not a Primus. This is not a Primus. The guy with the hood is a Primus. Yeah, this is not a Primus. Get out of here. Okay. And then I gotta decide where these guys are going. And to be honest, I don't think there's any point in putting these down right now, so they're just gonna hold off. These 10 uh, neophytes are just gonna hold off. All right. All right, so my movement phase is done. Where are all these shots going, Steve? Uh, all, all right. Sniper shots so, in the chat. Uh, the first one goes into, so you grab a dice. Uh, the first one goes into the Tech Marine. The Tech Marine, excellent, I like that idea. That had wounds, and D3 mortal wounds the Tech Marine? Two Two mortal wounds. mortal wounds, okay. Uh, the next one goes into the Wounded Dreadnought. Okay, there we go. It doesn't wound. Yeah. It fails to wound the dreadnought. Uh, the next one goes into the Rogel Dorn. So that's on me. Two up. Yeah, gets it. Uh, D3 mortals. Oop. Come on, D3 mortals. Two whole mortals. Does it explode? Dorn. Does the Rogel Dorn explode? The Rogel Dorn oh, is. I said the Rogel Dorn. I apologize. No. Rogel Dorn. Two wounds. Reset. Said? said two. Let's put it in the chat. Do you think that Nick listens to me when I talk? I'm or... listening, but I'm <laughs> confirming to make sure I have it right. I don't want to cheat you. <laughs> Oh boy! Oh Here my go. goodness! That's oh another my. five check. Now we're gonna uh, do that at the end of the next phase. Into the Lehman Russ on a two up. Oh no! It the Lehman Russ, Lehman Lehman Russ is alive. And then uh, after that, it was into the Land Raider on a two up. Yes. D three mortal wounds. Three. Three mortals. You can just uh, down move the, the counter down. That'd be great. Boom! Thank you. Thank you. That was uh, one of these. Boom! Look at that. Love every minute of it. All right, Maselia, cool. so thank then, you so much. Maselia, that's just that's, that's very, very generous. Out of bounds awesome is what yeah. it is. And so uh, what we'll do is we're, we're going to do his shooting phase. After Nick's shooting phase, we'll do the next five. And while he's doing his shooting phase, let's just take a uh, consensus in the chat for uh, where the shots are going. <laughs> so he's going to do this. And I can do my shooting phase, and then we'll chat, do it after. You all figure it out. Maybe give Maselia one, uh, one like, you know, for sure. This is where one is going. But go. <laughs> all right. Um, we are gonna go the the Rogel Dorn. It's gonna split fire, 
it's going to split fire. Boom, look at um, that. And it's going to fire its, um, fire its Meltas into this rhino right. right in front of us. Here we go. Um, I'm every minute of that. It's going to fire everything else at, uh, at these terminators right here. OK. Got to do some damage to uh, I am going to. What are you going to do? Nope, just keep going. Okay. Uh, Melt yeah, us into the rhino. I did say he's out of bounds. Out of bounds, awesome. One hit. And one wound at minus four. One wound at minus four into it's the terminators. Four? No, no, this is at the rhino. Oh, at the rhino. Okay, yep. Just I take it. And it does four, five, six damage. Six damage to Deadly Demise. Does it explode? Yeah, it explodes. It explodes. Okay, let's do the theater. One, one two, two, three. three. Explosion! Yeah. <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> um, so. Does it just do one damage or three? Uh, the, ooh, good call. <laughs> uh, D3. D3, D3 all right, take D3 on the oh. Russ. Or, or roll with three the mortals. Down to three. That's three wounds remaining? The 13. Well, 13 wounds remaining. Down to right. 13. And then yeah. it needs to target its main target. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and target the uh, the uh, the Terminators. Um, so uh, heavy bolters first. Uh, so uh, Jane of the Sheep, question for Steve: Have you heard about your masters yet? Yes, I was successful. I actually congratulations, uh, Steve. Yeah, I actually graduated. Uh, we can like call sort of top of my class, actually. We can call him chapter master. I was in the Steve. Oh, chapter master, Steve. Yeah, hey, got sustained. Yeah, I, I performed very very well, and um, I'm very very happy with the success of my masters. I'm making I'm. Making great strides professionally. T5 or T4? Uh, they are tough as five. All right, just one wound from the heavy bolters. Uh, AP1 to two damage, right? Yep. Um, sounds uh, good. I am uh, would be in cover. I'm good. Four of invul. Uh, and so I'm doing very well. Uh, am I on summer holidays now? Yes, that's why I'm here at, uh, you know, two, oh, sorry, 150 Pacific Standard Time on a Friday. Oh, <laughs> not great. One from, from the, uh, the Gatling Cannon? Oh, not phenomenal. Ooh, it was terrible. Ah, feeling good about it. And then the, uh, the big giant gun. And uh, yeah, I'm fairly positive. Oh, sorry, Coaxial Cannon first. Fairly positive Nick doesn't listen to me when Once. I speak out loud, but that's OK. One wound at minus one from the Coaxial Auto Cannon. Uh, one wound, what's sorry? Coaxial Auto Cannon. Oh, I see. There's one, one wound. I'm minus totally one. fine. OK. And they then, love it. Lastly, the big giant gun. They want to take it. Yeah, the big giant gun. Pulverizer Cannon. Oh, my. D6 shots. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Four, five, that six. That is the stuff. Uh, it is strength nine. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait. Are you blast? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Yeah, seven. Okay. Seven wounds at minus three. They do three damage each. Four open balls. Woo! Go, Paul Bryce. We can't from the Four damage piece. They do three damage piece. Three damage piece. I all One, the two, terminators. Three, four. Die. Yeah! All the terminators go, die. Go Rogel Dorn! Boom, boom, boom! Look at that. Bam. And then <laughs> split fire worked. Did it? It did. I killed two did things it? with it. Steven Box in the comment section, please tell him that split fire doesn't work. That'd be great. <laughs> now now I now my uh, abominant can charge your uh, your uh, character there. Oh yeah. Uh, Lehman Russ is gonna fire. It's gonna fire everything into the wounded dreadnought. I love it. I love it. The Wounded Dreadnought, let's see if I can do it. D6 plus three shots. Five, six, seven, eight. And I'm hitting minus, minus one. So you're in fives now. Five, six, seven, eight, yep. Yeah. On fives, three hits. Rerolling ones, because Lehman Russes can do that naturally. Ooh, look at that. Specifically the battle cannon. Straight nine, so on fives. Uh, nothing. I love it. Nothing. I'm loving it. La Laz cannon, misses. All missed. All right, moving on to the last unit that I have to shoot, which is that unit back there, all into those infantry over there. Sounds good to me. All right, so I got demo charges first. Okay, might as well shoot them. Um, actually, no, we're gonna start first with the, where are the acolytes there? We're gonna spend a command point on um, grenade stratagem. Okay. So those guys over there, those acolytes, into those, those, those infantry. Guys? Yeah, okay. And I got five mortal wounds. Cool. So good. Rough. Killed two and a half. Sounds good. And then they are going to, then they've going to take their uh, demo demolition charges. And I think I have uh, up to two 
can have demolition charges. Yeah, two demolition charges, the one-shot weapons. There are D6 plus three shots for each one. Uh, I, I'm, I hope I don't kill you too much, actually. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. These are hitting on fours, but I have a Primus in here, and the Primus allows me, if I'm reading this, reroll the hit rolls. So I failed four, but I reroll the hit rolls. And, oh, as I come out of uh, Cult Ambush, I have sustained. Sustained one and ignores cover. Yep, so look at all those sixes. Four, three, four, five, five more dice. One, two, three, four, five. I might wipe this unit and not take the objective away from you. Yeah, I might have uh, over, overplayed these guys. Hilarious. I, <laughs> actually, yeah, that's probably gonna happen here. Cause it's strength 12. Oh, these guys are super dead. So yeah. winning on twos. Yeah. Um, it's uh, minus two that do two damage each. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. But then I gotta take hazard test rules after that. Oh look, they're dead. Are they? Oh yeah. They're not it's actually. It's minus two, man. It's minus two. Yeah. You only failed two, three, four. Oh, how yeah, much damage them. are they APs? Uh, they're two damage each. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah they're okay. super dead. Wow, I wanted not to kill them. <laughs> okay. Super dead. And then the uh, the acolytes have to take a hazard test, and none of them die. Okay. Okay, well, I was hoping to yeah. get on the objective there. No, it didn't happen though. <sighs> I didn't capture enemy outpost then. All right, great. So we have five more to do. So what was the- That's the end of my shooting was, phase. What was the deal at the end of the shooting phase? Owen, did you see at all where some of the shots were gonna go? Yeah, I got, uh, it was, we had secondary, we did that one. Yeah. Uh, Dreadnought, Yeah, we did that. Oh, we, it was it, the same, we got a second set though. Oh, we got, oh wow. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Zio, welcome, know, Plan Supporter. Thank you so much. I don't know if we actually had many in the chat that were. Uh, I saw a lot of people talking it. about it, but that was at the time when yeah. they were doing it. You'd have to go scroll up in the chat. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we'll if you're just joining us, what's happening is one way we can support the channel and what we do for these, some of these live streams is allow an opportunity for you guys in the chat to take part in the game by firing the sniper. This happens whenever we get to $50 total of Super Chats. And one person just donated 50 memberships, which is the equivalent of five sniper shots, which is amazing. Um, so we have five sniper shots to go right now, but we're trying to figure out where they are. I saw a Rogaldorn, so one for the Rogaldorn. Um, let's just see where, where, they're, where they're going here. Uh, yeah. Lehman Russ, Russ, two for right. the Lehman Russ. Uh, oh, Maselli said abominance. Oh, At least yeah. one on the, uh, well, the bombers are dead, but I'm assuming the, yeah, the guy, the big guy. Um, and one, hey, let's do the last one random. Sounds good. All sure. right, so one, uh, Rogaldorn. Oh, rad, look at one that. for the Rogaldorn. Rogaldorn on a two up. Yeah, takes so it. So Rogaldorn taking D3 mortal wounds. Taking what? Just one, down to 12. Okay, and then one into the Lehman Russ. In Lehman Russ, who only has one wound. It wounds. And he's dead. And he dies. Does he explode? He can't do anything if he explodes. He explodes! You can't do anything. I know, but it's cool to press the button. Ah, look at that. <laughs> I'll press it too, hold on. <laughs> Yeah, look at that. Bye bye, Lehman Russ. Bye, Lehman Russ. He did okay. Yeah, he did okay. Actually, no, he didn't do anything. No, he, he shot him. He, he could just. He shot him oh, that's twice true. He actually nothing. didn't really do anything. He didn't do a thing in this game. Uh, uh, and then the dreadnought. Oh yes. <laughs> so dreadnought. that was that. The yep. dreadnought into the dreadnought on a two. It cool. hits and does one mortal one wound to the mortal dreadnought. One wound. It was down to three. Down one more. Uh, so that was three so far, and then one into the abominant. Yep. You want to fire that one? Yeah, sure. Go on a two up. It wounds. D three. Another three. So four up feel no pains does he have? Uh, for the abominant? He has a, he's the same, he's a four up feel no pain. So three mortal wounds. Awesome. None of them. How many wounds does he have? He has five wounds, so he's Ooh, down to he's two. two left, okay. Oof, oof, sounds that's good. no fun. Sounds good, sounds good. I don't sounds like good. that at sounds all. Uh, and then the last one was random, right? Last one we said we're gonna do random. All right, Alrighty. so one, two, three is me, four, four, six is you. One, two, three is me. All right, well, so I, uh, I want to wound this uh, oh, the Terminator that, that I'm about to go into. Sounds good. All right, into the Terminator, Captain. That's a wound, and it Damage. does. One mortal wound. One whole mortal wound. Sounds good. Uh, so he's got five wounds remaining, this guy. Okay, and then charge phase. Sounds good. I'm going to charge my abominant into your... Denarth Lysander. Lord Raul, this donation oh, is all F, for you, Tac. Uh, uh, being awesome. Well, Tac is pretty cool. We love Tac. All right, do I make it in? Don't roll double ones. I'm in. 
Cool, I'm gonna go in such a way that I can also hold the objective. Yep. And so we have two characters right here. I'm gonna move them so that overhead can see, oh, no, I'll just keep them here. They're right there, I want the overhead to be able to see it. There is a librarian, or is it a Terminator captain? Who is he? Uh, Darnath Lysander. He's a special Imperial fist guy. So the starting, uh, the start of the um, fight phase happens, right? Yeah. So at the beginning of the fight phase, Darnath Lysander uses his ability Rampart. Once, you can fight first. Nope. Once per battle, at the start of any phase, this model can use this ability. If it does, until the end of the phase, it is a two-up and vulnerable save. Oh, oh yeah. That's so good. That's the stuff. So for the, until the end of this fight phase, he has a two-up invul. Well, my bombinet is saying, screw your two-up invulnerable. I'm going to try to kill you with my devastating wound sledgehammer. Except he doesn't have devastating wounds. I was wrong about that. I thought he had devastating wounds. Nope, he doesn't have devastating wounds. <laughs> Great. <laughs> All right, so Abominant, three attacks, hitting on threes. Go for it, buddy. Hit two of them. Okay. Strength 12, two wounds at minus two. Two wounds at minus two. If there's a single one in there, you die. Yeah. Nope. Oh. Good to go. All right, fight me back. I'm fight going back. to. I am going Can I to. Can decap? Oh, yeah. So here we go. Uh, so I'm hitting you on twos with these five attacks. Feeling very good about it. What's uh? I'm toughness five or toughness six. Five. I mean, are you toughness six? Toughness six. So move you on threes because he's trying ten on threes. Oh, but so one save. Yep. Uh, that is AP three three damage. All right. So one save is three damage. So I just take my, just on my my mortals or feeling pains. Take two of them, one goes through, I'm down to one wound. And then six mortal wounds. Oh. Devastating, I, I, see, I legitimately, without making it up, have devastating wounds I've got my hammer. six four ups. Oh, come on, save yourself! No, he's no, dead. No, he dies. He dies hard. Um, however, he's the best rule to get back up on a two up. Oh, okay. So I roll dice and on a two up, set the model back up on the battlefield as close as possible, not within engagement range. Okay. With full wounds. On full wounds? Yeah. Okay. No! Oh, yes! <laughs> That's oh. perfect. So he dumped it. The objective left. is mine! Ah, oh, stupid guy. What's funny is, since you overkilled me here, yeah. because of their yeah. sticky objectives yeah. ability, I still, hold I, the objective. still hold the, I still have all the objectives. Like, I did well. Killing wise, but points wise, I'm really oh, yeah, behind. Oh yeah, you are really behind now. So I did manage to get behind enemy lines at the end of my turn here. Yep. So that'll give me um, uh, five points. Yep. Sorry, uh, yeah, five points. Yep. Um, but capture any outpost is still looting me. It is. But I'm pretty much guaranteed Probably to get Probably gonna get turn. that so next turn, let's be real. It's eight points. It's a lot of but points. The problem is I've now had two turns of not scoring it. Yeah, that's not great. So I'm gonna hold on to it. You may as well now, points. yeah. So I, uh, I completed behind enemy lines for those those five points, but I'm way behind on the score. Yeah. Well, well, not and yet. Th and then because you killed two of my units this turn, I guess I'm not that far behind. And I killed three of yours. Yeah. Uh, Actually, even more than that. I killed one, two, two. Yeah. Two, three. Kill the terminators. Where's the second unit? Unit back there. Unit here, and the rhino. Oh right. Yeah, you're right. I killed right. three units. Okay, and then I killed of yours. Oh, I killed the uh, the jackal and her squad. Yeah. Right? One, I killed two, the abominants. Three, four, and four, five. Five. So I get five. four points. Yep. Four. There you go. So I get another four points at the end. Um, Owen? Uh, you know, Masselia wants to check if I'm within three inches of the objective. I the did picture. check. He is, it's he is outside. It's close. It's, it's close. very, very close, but he is not within three. Yeah. Uh, no, that no, was Steve that got them. I got points. them, that's yeah. What he, yeah. That's what we were just saying there. Alrighty, so we end round two, <sighs> and we go into round three. Oh. So uh, we each gain a command point, so I go to three command points, and you go to one command point, right? Um, I I hate orcs. You can go to either Baron of Dice or Muse on Minis. Both of them sell our, uh, yeah. our dice. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so uh, I go to three command points, you go to one command point. Yep. Uh, and then uh, I uh, pull for my secondaries, I engage on all fronts and cleanse. Uh, okay, I don't think I'm gonna be able to pull off engage on all fronts, unfortunately, but that's okay. I'm gonna be able to do cleanse. Yeah, you only uh, have four units left. Yes. Uh, and then Two I- Two dreadnoughts. Oh, no, five units. Uh, 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 it's tech brain. 
And then I score eight points on primary. Yeah, you did well. Because I, I control an objective, and then I control more objectives than you. So I get eight points. Ordron A, I, I not, probably not pronouncing that right. Ordron A. Nelson. Uh, Steve, if I'm going to paint Leviathan Space Marine part and don't want it, want Ultra Marines, what chapter would best fit the unit included? Salamanders would be pretty good. The Salamanders, Salamanders would be really, really good. Yeah. Uh, you also can make a really good argument for Imperial Fists, too, because there's Terminators with uh, bolt guns and the Dreadnought with all the heavy weapons. Even the Flamers and stuff, like in the lore, like they're really good at like breaching places and like uh, boarding and stuff like that. Yep. And the Flamers, you could uh, make a really good argument that it would help them uh, do that, plus like clear trenches and stuff like that. But uh, Imperial Fists, Salamanders would be a strong choice. Yep. Really any of them, but if I would choose, I would choose like yeah. those two would be my go-tos. Adam, these are Bernard Dice dice. These are these are his dice. So yeah. like he, he carries a few times some yeah. special ones. Like we had like a ones we made for Adepticon, for instance. All right. So during my command step, yeah. uh, the uh, I am going to give this dreadnought plus one to hit and heal it D three, and I heal it three. So it goes from three to six, bringing it out of its damage state. Ah, uh, yeah, smart, smart. Uh, and then it gets plus one to hit as well, which feels good. So it's no longer battle shocked. You do no. have to take ba battle shock on your. I do need to take. Your, oh no, it's uh, less than half. He's he's got the, four wounds. He's, he's got four and wounds. No, he has don't. two left. Right? Uh, the land raider yeah. needs to take a battle shock test. Oh yes, it does. The land raider's got to take battle shock. Uh, it actually oh, does. It fails. is battle shock. Land raider's battle shock. The guys I, inside are like crazy. Yeah. And I still do hold more objectives than you, which is. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't actually. I won't then. So I won't get the four points. Why not? You hold oh, three. actually, you know what? I'm just gonna. I'm just going to. Um, Why not? You hold three. No, oh, because of the battle no, shock test. Right. Uh, I'm actually just going to uh, spend use the command point. Use the command point. Going down to two command pass, points yeah. for insane bravery, so that you can hold this one with the yeah, map. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, all right. Now. Now then. How many wounds is this? Uh, is twelve left? Eh. Is okay. Is that the atom that I talked? Okay, atom rainbow. Is that the atom that I talked to you from uh, the, the app? The app is treating me really well. It's working pretty good. Thank you very much. Excellent. Uh, Feels good. Okay, so I've got to clear some stuff out here. Uh, and I think what's going to take place is my Land Raider is going to just hang out on the objective because the objective is king. Thomas Rose, Muse on minis. Muse, um, M U S E, on. Uh, minis. Would you mind taking that Dreadnought? Uh, sorry, I'm going to go into the Devastator Doctrine, is what I'm going to do. Uh, and then uh, what's going to happen is I would like you to please take that Dreadnought. And the one in the back corner there. Yeah. And uh, for actually, before I continue, so, just going to ensure sorry, that. Can I pause one second? I just want to respond to that. Sorry, I was wrong. The UK supplier for dice. We actually do have a UK supplier for dice, and is Wayland Games. Wayland Games Games carries our dice. Okay, awesome. Cool. Uh, so I'm going into the Dev Doctrine. Yep. Uh, and then the that dreadnought there is going to advance, and it's going to advance uh, along the back okay. here. Uh, oh, come on. <laughs> And it's going to advance four inches, so it goes 12 in total. Great, thank you. Um, and then uh, this guy here is just, we're just going to move back a little bit, yep. kind of hide. Uh, and then if you could please take that dreadnought and just move it eight inches right up the street. Oh, actually, it's going to advance as well, funny yep. enough. That's what's going to happen. It's going to advance as well. Uh, three inches. Three, so you're here. Perfect. Good, you're out. Excellent. Great. Uh, okay, fantastic. <laughs> Feeling very good about it. Uh, all right, so uh, here's, oh, and then the the, um, uh, the tech marine is going to advance right behind uh, the dreadnought, or as close as it can be. Uh, it goes five, so it goes 11 inches, the tech marine does. Okay. And you just want to be right behind the dreadnought. If possible, yeah. yeah. Within three inches of it, for sure, yeah. so I still get low and operative. You're there. Perfect. Oh, you only get low and operative for within three inches of the vehicle? Yeah. That's an interesting yeah. rule. I like that. Yeah. Because it lets him babysit yeah. like a vehicle of yeah. some kind, right? Uh, okay, great. So then what's going to take place uh, is I'm going to move into my shooting phase. You don't have any snipers and stuff to go. So uh, what's going to happen is I'm going to start with the Dreadnought back here. And the Dreadnought back here is going to shoot everything into this squad. <laughs> uh, and I'm going to spend one of my two command points. So I go down to one command point, Owen. Uh, and I'm going to give it Storm of Fire so it has ignores cover. Uh, and well, to be... To be kind to you, before you spend that command point, I'm going to spend a command point on you can't target them, and they have stealth. Right. Okay. Sure. Um, right. Keep forgetting that you can do that. You can do it with any unit. Any infantry unit. Any infantry unit, eh? Yeah. Oh, okay. You can still do that against this unit. 
Uh, no, that's gonna shoot this. Okay. So yeah, that unit is untargetable outside of 12. Okay. You okay. can choose a new target if you have one, but I don't think you have one with that guy. All good. Uh, so I think what's gonna one happen- One with the shadows is really strong and yeah, really it's, good. It's really good. Yeah. Uh, all right, so uh, I'm just gonna take the, um, uh, Dreadnought is gonna shoot into the um, Rogal Dorn, which is my oath target. And the- Just back to two command points, because he didn't use it. I didn't use it. Because yeah. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so uh, D6 shots uh, from the uh, frag. So, so then with, with that being said then, yeah. I'll spend the CP here yeah. to do uh, AP minus one because it's Dev Doctrine and ignoring cover. So because you're obscured, you won't get the extra AP. Makes sense. Sorry, the extra save. Yeah. Uh, so D6 shots off of uh, the frag storm grenade launcher. The one whole shot feels great. Uh, and this is on sixes re-rolling. No, re-rolling. No. Uh, and then, one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, onslaught Gatling Cannon. Uh, this is hitting on threes, re-rolling all of them. And then, right. uh, this is wounding on T12, right? Uh, Rule of Dorn is T12. T12, so this is on sixes, re-rolling. Ooh, nothing. Re-rolling. Oh, uh, so one. one mortal wound. How much damage is this? Yeah, how much damage is this gonna do? One mortal wound. Oh, sorry. I thought I was doing more Again, than that. Chad, if anyone feels as I'm if- I'm not doing it on purpose. I'm reading, I'm trying to figure out, because once, <laughs> once per game, I can make something do zero damage. Oh, okay. Yeah, I well, would you, this was the time to do it. I don't think it's one mortal the wound's the time to do it. So I can't do anything against it, so nope. it goes down to 11 wounds. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so D3 shots off the rocket. Uh, so three shots off the rocket pod. On threes, you're rolling. All of them. Uh, strength eight, so it's on fives, re rolling. Uh, so two AP minus twos, two damage. Ooh, save neither. Ooh, four damage in total. Oof. Uh, so down to ten, and then down to six. Yeah. Ooh. And then. Oh uh, wait. Uh, so we're down to seven. Okay. Because it's four damage total. Yeah. Yeah. And then D six plus one shots off the macroplasma incinerator, and I am overcharging here. Uh, so ooh, six whole shots. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is what it's all about. This is where you probably want to do the one of them becomes nothing. Yeah. Uh, so on threes, re-rolling. Woo! Uh, so five hits in total. And this is strength uh, nine, so on fives, re-rolling. Oh, rough. Uh, so three AP fours. Oof, and these do multiple damage. And they do three damage a piece, yeah. All right, so I'll take one of them and make okay. it do zero. And then and I'll then try to save two of them at maybe three. Four. Maybe four. Does it have a two-up save? It has a two-up save. So you need sixes. Uh, from this guy? Yeah. It ignores cover. Oh, it ignores cover, got Because it. of Storm of Fire. Neither. Uh, death. It does, it it's explodes. four damage each. It's three damage piece. So I have, I have seven wounds, so I have one wound left. Oh, okay, so I, I yeah, you're one right. So yeah, we have one I have left. one wound yeah. left. You have one wound left. Excellent, I got one wound left! You one can do it! One wound left. Good job, Rogaldorn! Good job, Rogaldorn. Uh, okay, cool, so then... Uh, the Land Raider and uh, Darnath Lysander. We'll shoot the Rogaldorn? Uh, no, they are both uh, going to cleanse the center objectives. <gasps> right. They're scrub them up. Oh, we have multiple center objectives in this one. Yeah. 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 All right, yeah. so, uh, cool. Over the points there. And then, uh, then that, so I'm not going to declare any charges or anything. Uh, so I'm going to get four points off of cleanse. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Uh, that's not true. I get five points off of cleanse. Hmm. So the yeah. So at the end of my turn, I get five points off of cleanse, and then I'm going to discard engage in all fronts to gain a command point, and then I will send uh, it to your turn three, my friend. <sighs> okay. 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 Well, I get a command point at the beginning of my turn, uh, and I hold. Two objectives, but that one I need to uh, Battleshock test first. Battleshock test. Oh, no. I will spend so a command point. And your one CP. So that I have insane bravery, so I hold that objective. So I hold yeah. two objectives. Does this guy give me a command point on a four up? I do get command points, so I'm back to one command point. Wait. Oh, I got, never mind. Continue. I haven't got a spare one yet. Okay, that's this round. I didn't discard an objective. Yeah. Um, at the end of your command step. Oh, at the end of your, oh shoot, at the end of your movement phase, I was supposed to put the unit here. I keep forgetting because in your it's in your reinforcement step that I put the, the spare unit. Would you have shot them if they were here? I don't know, but put them there anyways. Okay. Are you sure? Because I, I just don't know. Just put them there anyways. It's okay. 
It's the big bike unit. Or wait, do, you, do they have to come in the turn after? Uh, they don't, but they can come the turn. Uh, oh, then just keep them, just put them down this turn. Yep. Yeah, okay. You won't get to do anything, but okay. Isn't that the fair way to do it? <laughs> sure. I mean, you, you can, that's okay. Like you it's can. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I just need the reinforcements, Steve. I just need the reinforcements. All right. Um, okay, so I'm gonna give my turn also draw another objective, or, or secondary card. Attempting target. So can you choose one of the ones in no man's land for me to try to get? Sure. Uh, the one over by the land raider. Yeah, okay. Actually, no. Uh, the the one in the middle with um, yep. yeah yep. with Dorn. All right. Um, then it's my movement phase. These guys are just gonna hide behind here. Yeah, you can't see them. Makes sense. Holding the objective. Uh, that guy's gonna. He's got the objective. He's got targets. He's gonna sit there and shoot. Yep. Um, these guys are going to move and advance to go. Get just on the objective. Right They're just hiding. Uh, three inches. So put them where best they can do to hide. They just want to hide from like this. They guy. want to hide from the dreadnought okay. and the, the the thing here. Um, that'll give me finally capture on the outpost and tempting target. Uh, I will see patriarch. Patriarch's gonna advance. Six. Eight plus six is uh, four, 14. 14. This guy's going 14 inches. As fast as I can get over here. You want him to go right here? I'm gonna try to charge your tech marine. Oh, wh where can I get to? I can get to there? Not really great. It's, it's, just, hide, it's just hide behind here. Okay. It's, it, the problem is you have to go, like... Yep, yeah, I gotta go up and over. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Right here. Four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then, for one CP, I'm gonna deposit these guys within three inches of the objective right here. Oh, okay. So I have no CP left. I'm taking the objective away from you because this is a tempting target. Yeah. Excellent. And it, it takes a CP to do that? Yeah. Okay. okay. Got the object away from you. Um, okay, so the bikes. Yeah, we'll wait till next turn. Okay. Okay, that's it. Okay, great. Shooting phase. Shooting. Um, the Rogal Dorn is gonna fire. Oh, I've got two two different targets to fire at. You know, what? I'm gonna fire all the cultists into the dreadnought. Sounds good. Uh, the dreadnought because they have Webers, which can give me devastating wounds. Maybe. Oh, I wish I had a command point so bad for a grenade stratagem. No go for you. Be good. Um. All right, Webers, D6 shots. Uh, what's the AP on this? Uh, nothing. All your guns are AP nothing? All my guns are AP nothing. Okay, how about okay. it? Four, five shots. One, two, three, four, five shots. I'm looking for sixes. Sixes more wounds. Okay. There's the Dreadnought, no sixes. Okay. Doesn't wound. Uh, I'm not gonna bother fighting our, uh, the little guns because I'll wound on sixes. All right, sounds um, good. So that whiffs, that's fine. It was just it was just trying to get fishing for sixes there. Yeah. Uh, but that what that does is decide for the Rogaldor and what he needs to shoot at. Both of these are terrifying targets. Um, but your Dreadnought is both faster and longer range. So I'm gonna shoot yeah. at the Dreadnought. Um, and I think I have a better chance of killing it, actually. Uh, but, unfortunately, my Melta, I gotta shoot my Meltas at your character. So, Steve, Meltas and Heavy Bolters, everything else here. Okay, and I am going to spend one command point. Going down to one. Uh, and I am going to Armor of Contempt the um, Dreadnought. So all the weapons that go into there are le one less AP. Yeah, into going to the dreadnought. Dreadnought. Yeah. 
Uh, all right, so into the character first, the two Melta shots. Here we go. And on fives, I got one hit. Uh, yeah, one wound at, well, wait. Nine, no, you're T5. T5 Did not yeah. wound. No wounds. All right. Um, and then the heavy bolters. Got two sustained. So that's four hits in total, because I'm hitting on fives, because I'm wounded. Yes, you are damaged. And that is three wounds at minus one. That sounds good, minus the character. one. Uh, so two in cover, two ups. Yeah. Uh, good to go. Not not none. Um, would have been on threes because uh, it was minus one, right? Correct, but the so the wording on the thing is that you can't go yeah. from a three up yeah. to a two up. Yeah. I have a two up. Oh, you have a two, of course. It's a, yeah, it's a, it's a Terminator. A, yeah, yeah, it's a Terminator. And then the big giant pulverizer cannon. Uh, actually, sorry, uh, the galley cannon also doesn't make any sense to fire at the dreadnought. It's an infantry weapon. Do you mind? Oh, is it AP nothing? Yeah. Do they have the same wounds or whatever? No. Oh, okay. It's yeah. just 12 shots. Sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Ba boom! Uh, sorry, it's AP 1, but you don't care about oh, it. Oh, it's in cover. Okay. Uh, you are in cover, so you don't care about that at all. I only hit you three times. Uh, three wounds. No, my, oh, AP 1, but you still get your two up because you're in Sounds cover. Good. good to go. All right, and the big giant gun at the Dreadnought. See if I can kill it. Uh, All right, here we go. D, uh, pulverizer cannon, nope, oppressor cannon. D6 plus three shots. No, you, you said it was a pulverizer cannon. You you shot a pulverizer cannon at me last time. You are correct. So whatever the pulverizer is, that's... Uh, yeah, sorry, I, it was one shot. Hit okay. on five, it hits, and doesn't wound. All right, okay. Sounds good to me. Okay. I think I misspoke what the word was. I think it is an oppressor cannon, but they're, they're, he basically has two different cannons. One switches out this, one switches out this. Regardless, oh. it missed. So what? All good. Okay, sure. Um, so what, but let's so let's make the decision. Like, what he, does he, this have? This, this giant gun is the bigger one. It is the uh, oppressor cannon because that's okay. the one that's strength twelve. Okay, sounds good. Yeah. So from now on, I called it oppressor. the wrong thing, but I did the stats of the. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Okay. Hmm. That's it. Okay. That's all I got. Great. So I took the objective away. I did I did both my objectives. Didn't kill anything. Uh, for attempting target and capture any outpost. So that scores me eight points for capture any outpost and five points for attempting target. Okay. That's good. So decent scoring turn. Yeah. Whew. Lord but Rahul, it... Steve, when will you be playing the Blood Angels and Sven Gwynwari Guard again? Hopefully soon. I haven't, uh, we don't have anything on the docket quite yet for Blood Angels. I mean, I could, bust them out in a uh, game, uh, like in a 40K and 40M. However, I will say that my Blood Angels collection took a real hit recently. Uh, it is mostly old school yeah. Marines, and a lot of it is jump pack dudes. Yeah. And so the loss of regular assault squads, like, is rough. Um, so I've oh got a little God. bit of converting to do. They can be run as Vanguard vets and jump packs and stuff like that, but that, yeah. that army consists yeah. of a lot of mini Marines and uh, there's a lot of scouts and there's a lot of jump pack dudes. And luckily there's also a lot of like de death company and stuff, which we're not legends, yeah. but it's still, it, it, it took a bit of a blow, but I could still make it work, I think. Hopefully get an analog soon that you just count them as. Yeah. I, I, they've got to be coming with an assault Marine. It doesn't really exist. Yeah, but they'll want you to use the, a new one. I know, but you could analog them as a... And they may not. I don't know. Yeah, who knows? They might right. not. Um, okay, so that's the end of my turn. That's yeah. the end of the round. Um, you killed more units than I did. Yeah. So you get the I get four, four points. Four points now. Well, you're in a commanding lead there, 34 to 26. Is that it? Is that what it is? Yeah. 34 to 26, yeah. yeah. All right, we go into turn four. Turn four. This game is close. All right, so I go to two command points and you go to one command yep. point. Uh, time to draw my cards. I drew bring it down. Oh yeah, and defend oh. stronghold. Hold your home hold objective. This oh, I don't one think that you're gonna be able to hold your home objective. Mm, that's gonna be tough, but uh, maybe. I mean, yeah. maybe. Um, but it will be tough. I think it, it is gonna be tough. Although, uh, yeah. probably what I am going to do to try my best, anyways, to make yeah. that happen, uh, is for my command step. I'm going to call the um, unit. Uh, I'm gonna call the. Um, Patriarch as my Oath of Moment. 
Makes sense. Um, um, and by then, the way, Sir Duckbot made a really good uh, point that out here on Planet Tabletop, you can still bring those Legends units. Oh, I totally could. We'll, yeah, we'll yeah. still play some oh, Blood yeah. Angel games for sure. Yeah, and and also too, like what's great about Legends stuff is we play a lot of narrative style play yep. on Play on Tabletop, Just and so for that. when we do our like you know Legends uh, series or whatever, right? Like when we perfect play, excuse for Legends, literally models. perfect. So yeah. I've got lots, and I totally will find lots of use, lots yeah. of use for them here at Play on Tabletop. So I'm not I'm not particularly worried, but for matched play and for like 40k and 40m and stuff like that, it you know. Yeah. It, it hurt a little bit, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, all right, so I'm going to select the Assault Doctrine as my Doctrine this okay. turn. Okay. So that I can advance and charge. Yeah. Um, and, uh, yeah, and then uh, I also need, I also owe you some Battleshock tests as well. Yep. Um, so the, oh, actually, I sorry, not <laughs> quite yet. Uh, I am going to heal the Dreadnought, D3, oh. and give it a plus one to hit. So I heal it three. That and Dreadnought you, used to be at... Four wounds. At uh, three wounds. And what is it now? Uh, now it's at nine. Now it's at nine. Yeah. Feeling good about things. Uh, okay, great. Uh, so. I What I've lost, unfortunately, is my oomph. And then I am going to spend one command in point. This, in, this, in this game. And I'm going to adaptive. Uh, yeah, I'm going to adaptive uh, strategy uh, the dread into the devastator doctrine. So we can advance and charge. Advance and That's shoot. That's smart. Oh, advance and shoot. Okay. And I, I, but so you're gonna the try rest to get of my, here, my kill. The rest of my Makes army sense. is in the assault doctrine, where they can advance and charge. Got it. Alrighty. So here we go. Uh, I am going to. I owe you a battle shock test on the land raider. Oh yeah. Uh, which I'm fine. I'm good. So he holds the objective. Uh, so he holds the objective. Uh, and so that and means you hold one objective. I hold one objective, which means I score my four points. Four points more for Steve, putting me yep. at thirty-eight. Yep. Mm -hmm. And here we go. I think I'll be able to pull this off. I hope so anyways. Um, so here is what I want slash need. Mm. Uh, so I am going to take uh, Denarth Lysander, and he's going to advance. Go six. Go yeah, the fact that my abominant didn't get back up to try to get you is a big deal. Oh, no. That's so close. Yeah, I'm just going to take this. You. Yeah. Yeah, that's trouble, man. Uh, and then uh, my uh, the Dreadnought that is in the Devastator Doctrine is going to advance three whole inches. Imagine 11 inches. I'm going to go right here. Hopefully clean up the Macalite. Uh, yeah, those guys are toast. And then uh, this Dready here is going to just move a little bit. Need one inch away, right there. Sounds good. And then we hang. Then we hang. All right, cool. Uh, you can put the sniper back on top if you'd like, please. Okay, is that the end of your movement phase? That's the end of my movement phase. Okay, then I'll bring my bikes back. Okay. <laughs> All right, you can go. Well, you're shooting while well. I put them there. Okay, sounds good. Dun, 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 All right, uh, so the uh, Dreadnought is going to shoot everything into your Acolytes. Uh, so, uh, uh, so D6 blast, there's five of them, so D6 plus one shots off the Frag Storm Grenade Launcher, seven shots in total. Seven. Uh, so this is on threes. Bunch of misses, feels good. Uh, and then after that is on, uh, their Acolytes are toughness four. Toughness four, yeah. Okay, so on four is rerolling because it's twin linked. Uh, so two AP nothings. Two. <laughs> two five. Uh, I don't have cover from there. No, you're not going to get any cover there. Save one. Save one. So one of them goes. Yeah, take them. If you could take them off for me, that'd be yeah, great. Absolutely. I'll, I'll. We. One of them is going so far. Oh, gotcha. Uh, and then uh, the onslaught Gatling cannon. This is this dreadnought into here. Ooh, oh boy. yeah. Better believe it. Not the oath of Moment target because that's the correct patriarch. Uh, so uh, two more AP nothings. Uh, save one more. They killed more. two. So so two far. of them are gone. Uh, D three shots off of the rocket pod. So two shots. And this is on threes. Come on, baby. Nope. And then uh, D six plus one shots plus two shots because it blasts okay. off of the um, uh, uh, plasma incinerator. So five shots. And there's three left. You say? Yeah, you've killed two so far. I'm gonna. 
Uh, there's six in the unit because of the character. Oh, there's six in the unit? Okay, the character. it doesn't matter. Uh, so then on twos. Uh, so uh, two AP minus threes. Two more dead guys? Two more dead dudes. You've killed uh, so I have four, four or five. Four, four are dead. one guy left. The one guy plus the, um, uh, the guy with the hood. Yeah. There's two models left in there. Okay, that sounds good to me. Uh, can uh, the biker see my land raider? Uh, not yet. Not yet? Okay. Uh, so then, so and it's once they're shot at that they can move around? Is that it? How do uh, they? That, that was the enhancement. Oh, that's the enhancement. Oh, no, that's when you move around. That's, uh, okay. Yeah. And when they shoot, then they... Uh, it, that was only with the character. I don't have the character anymore because he died. Okay. All right, so here's what's going to happen then. Uh, what's going to take place is I am going to take the uh, Dreadnought, and the Dreadnought is going to shoot its Macroplasma here, um, its Rocket Pot here, and then all its Small Arm Fire into the Initiates in the, mid in the beginning there. Got so it. D6 plus one shots off of the Macroplasma. Yeah, and can I uh, hold on is the question here. Uh, so it's, I, I'm overcharging, of course. Uh, yeah. So these are on twos because I'm plus one to hit. So four hits. Uh, and then after that is on uh, fives. It's two AP4s. On the, on the drone? On, on the, the, uh, the, the drone, yeah. Door. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. No. No, absolutely not. No Steven Box Steven explodes. Does it explode? No. No, but we always say we, we roll explosions. It just doesn't explode. Yeah. No! And just last, uh, this is so cool. No, okay. It is really cool. It is a very, very cool thing. Uh, so then, uh, five AP nothings and one mortal into this squad here. Five AP nothings and a mortal wound. Actually, hold on, just give me, uh, give me one sec just to finish up the... Yeah. Okay, uh, so. One AP one, two damage. Save it. Oh, save it. And then five AP nothings. Okay. Four, uh, five ups. <laughs> no, uh, save none. So five dead. And then one mortal. So six dead. Okay. So uh, more than half is dead. Sounds good. Uh, five, six. There you go. Uh, what else you got for shooting? Anything else? Uh, unfortunately, no. Nothing else. Uh, so I'll just go to my charge phase. Um, the Dreadnought's going to charge those five Initiate dudes. He does with a 10. Man's a big, big guy. Oh, yeah. Dreadnought's in? Dreadnought's in. Uh, and then uh, uh, Lysander's going into the Patriarch with a 10. He's in. Slammed. Uh, and the Dreadnought can't, uh, can't charge, unfortunately. I would love to make that happen, but alas, no. Uh, and OK, cool. So then, uh, what's going to happen here is I'll start with, because you have a, a CP, but it's two CP to interrupt. It is two CP so to interrupt. You cannot interrupt, so I'll just start with this dread. So hitting on threes, um, on twos. Sorry, uh, the, at the start of the fight phase, um, you have to take a battle shock test with every unit that's in combat with the Patriarch. Uh, he's good. He's good. Awesome. So uh, into the, uh, with the dread Dreadnought into these guys here. See if you can kill four guys. Yeah, no. You couldn't do it? Uh, no, unfortunately. But you know what? I might see. Ooh, I... just kill that one guy. And he's a, they have a five up save? They have a five up save. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try CP this for VP. Oh, what? actually, no, it doesn't matter. Steve, if Steven Box taught me anything, it's trade CP for VP. <laughs> and that is right now not really worth the VP, so. Well, we, you, don't, okay. you don't have the objective right now. Uh, what's, what, but it, I'll kill three of them, right? Oh, and then their OC is only two. But your OC is three. My, my OC is four. Your OC is four, okay. Yeah, but even if that were the case, yep. if I kill three of them with these. Gotta kill three, yep. You got a good chance. you have one guy you left. You got a good chance. I still take it, yep. so. Uh, alrighty, so trade CP for VP. <laughs> so on twos. I'm gonna CP reroll this two oh, up. Oh, there is a CP for VP. There it is, yeah. So three at AP. So two. So I just, I oh, yeah. three dudes. You kill three. Uh, I got one guy left. Trade CP for VP. He's still got the cult banner though. CP I'll bring guys for back. VP. I'll bring some guys back. Uh, can he do that while he's battle shocked? Uh, I'd have to check. It's possible mm. not. 
Uh, okay, so uh, then uh, from Lysander. So on two's re-rolling, because you're my oath target. Oh, on our patriarch, yeah, right yeah. over here, yeah. Bunch of hits, all right. Uh, strength 10 to his toughness of five. Uh, his toughness is, where is he? Toughness of five, yep. Oh, on twos, re-rolling. So it's just five wounds. AP minus three, three damage a hit. Four up and vulnerable save. All right. No. I save one, two, I take, I take eight, nine 12. damage. 12 oh, sorry, damage. Nine, 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 nine. Nine damage and die. Death, that sucks. Get out of here. No! Kaboom! Smash its head in. Get out of here. Bye, Patriarch. Yeah, and I'm gonna consolidate right into base contact with this guy. I still got the objective though, don't I? Uh, probably, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's, well, actually, I don't actually, because you're probably OC, well, no, no you're yeah, OC I'm only one. OC one with Yeah, that so guy, I'm OC yeah. two there. Yeah. That's or no, okay. three, that'll be three. This, he's two, he's one. So. But they're gonna have to battle shock them. That is true, that so, is true. Oh, oh boy, feels great. All right, well, I'll try to hit you back over here. The cultist misses. No. And you go into there, the Primus will try to hit you. Sure. And you might regret fighting the Primus here. You might nothing. regret it I very regret much. Nothing. The Primus gets first his, first his cult bone sword. I regret absolutely nothing. With five attacks, hitting on twos. Hits all but one. Um, oh, no, I can reroll uh, hit rolls, because he's leading a unit. Yeah, hits all. Uh, Anti-infantry two. Oh. Wounds all of them at minus two. Whoa, what the? One damage each, but minus two. Whoa. Oh, okay. sorry, this is, no, sorry, apologies. That's a cult, cult bone sword. I have two weapons, that's the, this weapon is only strength five. So I do wound you four times, not five times. The other weapon is anti-infantry two, oh. which I'll be rolling in a second. These are minus two, one damage. Okay. Uh, so I take two damage. Take two damage, and then I hit you with my Toxin Injector Claw. I get two attacks hitting on twos. Hit them both, but I reroll hit rolls. Or sorry, hit once, uh, hit twice. Now I have Anti-Infantry anti 2. Which I wounded you twice. This is no AP, but it does D3 damage. Good to go. Whoa. Gonna fail those! Nice. That guy slapped He's actually pretty good, yeah. The He's not hell? bad. And then the other guy tries to hit you. And... He hits you twice, wounds you so, once. So it's five. Wounds yeah. you once on a six. Good to go. Awesome. Feels great. Good. All right. He Kate. loves it. He loves every minute of that. So that's the end of the round. How many points do you score? Uh, so end of the round. Or end of your uh, turn. I bring it down. How many wounds did that thing start with? Uh, 18. 18. Uh, so that means I get uh, two, four points. I get four, uh, sorry, five points. Five points for that. Five points for bring it down. Because I'm playing tactical. Yeah. Uh, and I don't have defense stronghold, unfortunately. You get your home base. But that's okay. I think I'm going to hold on to it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, actually, I have no TP. I'll go one. Hmm. You know what? I'm just going to hold on to it because I know it's doable. I know that it's doable. All right. Go for it. Okay. Um, so, at the beginning of my turn, I get a CP going up to two. Yeah, and I go to one CP. Um, I am going to take Battle Shock Tests over here. Before I do that, I'm gonna try to bring guys back over here. There we go. You just get dudes. I get dudes because I have a cult banner. Oh, so what does the cult banner say? Let's look it up. Yeah. Because you're right. No, it should just it's, be on your... Uh, it's not on the card. It's a, it's oh. a, yeah. I can't find it on here. Oh, there it is, sorry. I looked on the wrong sheet. Cult icon, uh, D3 plus three destroyed models to the unit instead. And if, if it's in range of an objective marker. If it's in range, yeah. not controlling. In the reinforcement step of the movement phase, you can return up to three oh, destroyed movement models. Movement phase. Reinf oh, there we go, so that's yeah. even different. Okay, so I do okay. control the objective. Yeah, I do right. control the objective. So you control this objective, and my battle shocked over there to not control that objective. Yeah. What's their What's their number? Well, the leadership of the Primus who's leading the unit is leadership six. Okay, so you, I pass it. Good. So we control that objective over there. Don't control this one, but I control this one. Okay. So that gives me four, Two. eight. Uh, it gives you, no, four. Because four. you don't control more than me. Got it. Right, because we control two. Got it. I control, yeah, I control two. So you got four it. points. So I got a total of four points. Yeah. Um, so add four points to the total there. And then I draw secondaries. 
Extend battle lines, control one or more objective markers in your own deployment zone, and one or more in no man's land. I think I can Cecilia, do that. Cecilia, have a great date night, enjoy. Thanks, man. Thank you so much for all your support and all the people that you gifted memberships are currently loving some exclusive content right now. And assassination, kill a character. All right, I think you can pull that, so you can pull it off. my target, I'm gonna try to kill this, this tech marine. Yeah. So I, it's gonna be really all down to the bikes. Yeah. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move them here. I'm going to use the grenade stratagem here, and then I use their um, their ability when they go past here with the demo charges. Right. So in the movement phase, I'm gonna try to blow up him, and then grenade stratagem him, and then charge him and kill two wounds off of him. That's the intent. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna try to do. Sounds good. Um, these guys, these infantry are gonna pop out so that they can use their guns to hopefully whittle a few wounds away. Sounds good. Okay. Um, he'll, I guess, stay in combat. Because although I'm just dead anyway, so I might as well stay in combat over there. Um, and that's all down to the bikes. Bikes are gonna move. Um, then um, I'm gonna fall back with this one guy here. Oh, I gotta test a battle shock test. See if he's battle shocked. I didn't actually test battle shock. Oh, okay. Because then it wouldn't be a uh, four, five, six, and they are leadership seven. So he fails battle, battle shock. I'm going to spend the command point on insane bravery that he falls back and doesn't have are to worry about. Are you allowed to insane bravery more than once per game? I'm pretty sure it's unlimited now. Is it? Well, but oh, okay. You can take a look if you want, no, but I'm fine. pretty Keep sure going. it's unlimited. And then at the end of my moon phase, he's gonna bring back D3 plus three. Uh, so that's one, two, three, four, five. Three, four, five. All right. Objective is mine again. All right. All right, so I've achieved one of my objectives. All right, so now as I move past this guy, I'm demo charging this thing. Um, so the demo charges are, uh, so as I pass you, uh, 10, 10 dice, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, drive-by demolitions, four off mortal wounds on this dreadnought. Here we go. Oh, I failed so bad, only three. Woo, all I right. I more than that. I love only that. Three. Only three. Oh, that's really disappointing. Feels great. Oh man. I'm okay with it. I need to do way better than that. I'm okay with it. Where's my jackals? Where's my jackals? Jackals, come back to me. I'm gonna shoot for the jackals. See, Damian Martin says once per game, but I can't see that in the core rules. I thought it was unlimited now. Yeah, I thought it was once per game too, but. Okay. All right. Yeah, insane bravery. Battleshock step of your command phase just after you failed a battleshock test for your army. Target the unit from your army. The battleshock is signet, even though you're about. Yeah. It doesn't say, oh well. Okay, then in the shooting phase, we are going to use the grenade strat for one command point yep. to grenade the Lehman, uh, the land raider. Yep, six of them. Six dice, one, two, three, four, five, six. So honestly, it's the biggest threat to these these bikes. Oh yeah, I imagine. Uh, so four ups, I'm hoping to get three three mortal wounds and kill the Lehman. On land average, raider. you kill it. Only one! Awesome. Oh, my strategy failed! Oh, All the mortal wounds, the demo charges didn't do it, and that That's, will probably cinch this game I for think you. that cinches the because game. Because I won't be able to kill them now. No. Um, so I'm just gonna shoot the, uh, shoot, try to get assassination now. So everything's yeah. targeting the... Yep, and see what happens. The, um, the whatchamacallit guy. So, tech uh, Marine? The Tech Marine. Flamers! Uh, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'll strike five, so one, two, three, four, five at minus one. Sounds good, five at minus one, and I'm not in cover or anything. Nope. Uh, so Ignore I've got my sweet, sweet uh, two up save, but it becomes a three up save because of your AP minus one. Away we go. And oh, I fail all of them. Oh, sorry, three of them. Which fail three of them, you. death. Kills you, so that gives me my assassination. Yeah. Um, and then, might as well, in the charge phase, uh, oh wait, I got a pistol over there. 
Oh, okay. uh, uh, the the Primus has a needle pistol. Ooh. Special pistol. Um, That's exciting. Yeah, it's anti entry two and does D3 damage. So it, it gives me one shot, hitting on a two. Miss. <laughs> but it's leading a unit, so I can reroll uh, hit rolls. Hits. Wounds on a two, it wounds. No minus, but does D3 damage. No minus, Don't D3 get a damage. One. I, I am gonna CP. <laughs> yeah, it does D3 damage, I could've killed you. Don't get a one! Aww. Play on. <laughs> Tack is looking over me and smiling. Yes, there you go. Um, his hand flamer's pistol, I might as well do that. The other guy's hand flamer. One shot, that was five. Nothing. No. Okay, uh, that's all the shooting. Uh, um, ongoing combats then? Uh, no, I'm gonna charge you. Oh, okay. These bikes are gonna charge the Land Raider because I can get onto the uh, thing. I'll also make you minus one to hit me. And you get onto the thing? Oh, I guess I guess I can't fit through there, can I? Yeah. You're a vehicle, so I can't get through you. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just tie you up. Okay. I've got, you know what, I've got power weapons. May as well get in there and try it. Yeah, I'm gonna try. So, yep. charging the Land Raider. Yep. Uh, with the bikes. Sounds good to me. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So all the way to eleven. So that means this guy can get all the way to there. Which means this is here. Which means this is here. Which means this is here. Which means yeah, now. Yeah, insane bravery is unlimited. Yeah, I Weird. thought it was. Pretty sure I thought it was. It I, get, I can get. I must be thinking of ninth. They must have made the insane bravery strat once per game in the in at the end of ninth ed or something like that. All right, uh, so I've got everybody but one in there. Yep. So that is, so let's fight that one first. Here we go. Uh, so that's nine guys, each with two attacks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Atlan power weapons, hitting you on fours. Wounding then on sixes? It is strength of four. Yeah, wounding on sixes. So sixes. Nothing. All right. All right. Ongoing combats. Ongoing combats. I'm sure you want to do that one over there. Oh, better believe it. Uh, so on twos. Whoosh. All of them hit you. <laughs> uh, and then on twos. Uh, so what's going to happen here is you have to make two AP minus three saves. Right through? Right. Okay. Three damage a hit. So I kill the one guy. Oh, sorry. He has a five up and vulnerable. So you kill right, the one so guy. I kill the one guy and then a five up invul. Nope. Okay. So this guy didn't take six wounds. He did. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's that. Uh, and then at the uh, oh, then you fight me back. Fight with the land raider. All oh, right. One wound. <laughs> all right, that's all she wrote. I think that's probably gonna spell at the end of the game here. I also score three points for defense stronghold at the end of your turn. So I like I scored assassination for five, and I scored ascend battle points for five. Um, and then I get another four points at the end of this battle round uh, because I killed more than he did in the battle round. And because I wasn't able to kill either the Land Raider or the Dreadnought with my amazing grenades, yeah. I should have. I really should have. Steve, 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 Nick? Steve, why not Overwatch the bike with the Dreadnought Land Raider? Yeah, you should have done it with the Land Raider. You probably could have picked up a few. You know what? The, over, the Overwatch strat is awesome, but if it's not the Oath of Moment target, it's just not worth it. <laughs> like, because you, and also too, like if you don't have a weapon that kind of like supersedes kind of, or you have enough volume yeah. to like make sure it happens, yeah. it's just not worth it. Digging for the sixes, it's not worth the CP. CP yeah. is too valuable in 10th yeah. edition yeah. to be kind of like willy nilly. I hope I kill one bike. Yeah. Right? Like yeah, it's, it, You're right, and you use it better over there. I use it better over here, right? Yeah, you so, do. So like, it's it's uh, 2.30, which means we've gone this for like a, uh, it's 248. Two, it was almost three hours. Yeah, now. almost three hours. And like to be honest, that is the end of the game. Oh, I yeah, won't be able yeah. to really score anymore. Yeah. Uh, you've taken that. Um, you will be able to wipe out this. You yeah. should be able to wipe out this because you'll be able to shoot in combat yeah. here. Uh, which means I'll be left with this one unit, which will score me four more points. Um, but really. And yeah, you're you've got such yeah. a lead. Uh, I can't catch you, unfortunately. Yeah. If this had worked, maybe I think yeah. I could have won the game actually. Yeah. If I could have killed this. So I think we'll end it there because that seems like a natural end of the totally. game. And the Gene Stealers will run away to fight another day. <laughs> yeah, o Oath of Moment is uh, Oath. The Oath of Moment um, is a uh, lasts for an entire battle lasts round. Lasts for an entire battle round. So yeah. yeah. So Lieutenant Dan Hooper, it totally yeah. does. Like you, 
you owe the moment something, it lasts the whole round, and then you just like crank into it with Overwatch. Yeah. It's really strong. Yeah, you had a really good Overwatch right there with those uh, at the very beginning there when the yeah. shot into those gene slurs. The gene really slurs ripped another unit. like four or five of them yeah. out. Like, yeah, yeah and it made you the know, unit much less effective. But you know, obviously, who actually won this game is chat because you killed yes. one, two, three, four, five units and really was instrumental in changing the pace of this game. <laughs> but defiantly, that Dreadnought stands in the middle having- He eight, does! You know what his so sniper much shots? Damage. He's got like so many bullet holes oh. in his chassis. A silly amount, a silly <laughs> amount. Steve, that was fun. Good it was a lot of fun. I concede. Yeah, well done. Yeah, there you it won. is. Thank you, you won, so much. Steve. And thank you, the Victor. Yo, oh, yes, the Victor. GG. Oh wait, wait. There's a Victor. There's a button. Ooh, you get to press it. Oh boy, here it's we Victor go. Victor button. The Victor. Yeah, look at that. Dun, 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 dun. Boom. Boom. I love it. I love it. It's so snazzy. <laughs> all right. So from everyone here at Play on Tabletop, thank you so much for all your support. The real winners are the chat, just like Nick says. And, uh, and before we go, we do have to make one more mention. Uh, there is a sponsor of the episode. Oh Frontline yes, Gaming. yep, you're Frontline right. Frontline Gaming Supply, the terrain here and the mat. You can buy this from their website. In fact, if you use the affiliate link in the description below, you support the channel through that. Yeah. Um, they provide an affiliate link for us so that you can get your stuff yeah. and also uh, support the channel. They also have amazing uh, Warhammer uh, supplies and miniatures and all sorts of stuff like that. Other, other ways you can support the channel is watching a stream like this yeah. or joining our membership or uh, or supporting us in Super Chat. Um, yeah. The membership has some amazing stuff in there. Some of you guys are new members. Thank you, Maselia and Nufi's Edge and a couple other people that donated memberships. Uh, I hope you guys take advantage of that and take a look at those, uh, those exclusive games. We have yeah. a lot of cool stuff on there. Uh, some really cool narrative games, like, yeah. like Hell on Wheels. Hell on Wheels. Hell, yeah, if, if you've just been gifted a membership, Go and watch the Hell on Wheels game that Nick and I played. It was so much. It was almost honestly too much fun. We just finished playing a game that was a lot of fun too. It was yes. com competing for it. That's how 40 came 40 m right? Yes, that is yes. going to come out publicly. That's yes. going to come out publicly. Um, but, we, so go and check it out. Go and see what we have behind the membership. Um, uh, and yeah. Yeah, I, I, there's we have so much content now, and it's also awesome. We're glad to have you. It really does support the channel. YouTube, yeah. YouTube uh, advertising is not enough to keep us going. No, uh, it does not pay the bills. No, not even close. But so, you guys, you, you do like viewers you like you. Aww. <laughs> so on that note, until we see you again in the far flung future of this grim dark universe. Play